Is my moto going to appear at all? At all? There it is. Hey, Fab, how's it going? Right. It's once again time to cause some pain to myself. Oh, am I actually still? Half jumping down, jumping, thing continues. Did that change anything? Hold on. Oh, but, but, pause. Don't knock me down, Jesus. I did just update it there. I don't know if it's just changed or not. I don't know if you're saying, uh, yeah, to, um, that I'm still in Genjin or, if, yeah, that I'm still, or I've changed to, uh, Jump King. I swear I updated it though before starting, but, yeah, okay, no, we're good. Yeah, yeah, thank you. Right, with that blunder out of the way already. Let me continue to bash my head against the wall for another few hours. And now we have the little timer at the top corner that you can barely see. At that point, it's literally just the thing I can see, like at the very top. Yeah, if I remember right, in Jump King, I actually did make progress, but then I fell, like, once, I think, and then I just fucked my progress forever, like. There we go, there we go. And the reason I had it set to Genjin is because I was legit thinking about playing Genjin or Honkai, but like... I don't know, just at the last second I decided not to. And I already had the feet Jump King part, so I was like, ah, screw it, I guess I'll just do a bit of Jump King instead, you know? <laughs> you shush, the, the, we, we don't talk about the time and I've, how I've spent a lot more time in this run of uh, Jump King than um, the original game. The original game I think I completed in 23 hours, the uh, first map, so... But this, literally, if you want to say anything, the fucking most time I've spent is literally in this section. Is it good, though? Okay, if you're saying you took 40, I'm definitely going to take at least 43. I'm worried now. <laughs> like, there's no way I'm going to be able to do it in good time. Unless I could just boss it here. If I can boss it here and get back up to the moss, I'll be a lot more careful. Well, I'd hope I can be a lot more careful. Oh my god. How am I literally struggling in this? Uh, for each... Hold on, let me stop for a minute. For each of the two maps. Good times for both of them. Uh, both of them, yeah. Honestly, I'm happy enough I completed the first one within 24 hours. <laughs> I'm just disappointed that I won't be able to get this done in that time, but as you said though, if you took 40 hours, I'm definitely going to take longer, like, too much. Oh, no, we're good. We're not good. I lied about my status. I am not okay. And to be fair, the reason I'm actually even here streaming is because I actually just did so much offline that, like, I was like, you know what, maybe to actually break up this some of this shit, I should actually stream. Because what have I made? I've made, like, two different videos, I think. For the first time in a while, actually editing videos. And it feels good, you know? Some of my exercises worked on Sherry Arbor's story. Oh my god, I'm gonna fall. Oh, no, I'm not gonna fall. I'm not gonna do thing. You sucked back then, though. Yeah, to be fair, I guess, like, when you're doing it for the first time, you will suck at it, like... Just like I'm sucking now myself, like, and I'm gonna fall. Nope. Okay, we're good. But, like, once you've done it once, you probably are used to, like... You know, you have that, like, um... Muscle memory, and you just know where you're going, like... Man. Literally makes progress and fucks it over, like... You can do it in, like, 35... Um, uh, hmm. Hmm, do I believe in this? You know what? I'll, I'll take it. If you think I can do it in 35, let's try and aim for 30. Okay, if I can fucking not do that kind of jump every single time I get there. You know, actually, this is a good spot to land down on. Usually it's a lot worse than this. But yeah, 35 hours. So that'd be basically another 9 hours time. But obviously I'm not going to stream for another 9 hours to try and complete it, but... 
I'll try and keep that in mind. I can't guarantee I'll remember that you've said that, but yeah. My memory is like Swiss cheese. Got holes in it. Because even just for names of people, like I swear like in my workplace, I like don't know everybody's names properly. At least one fella. And then, uh, whatchamacallit. There's someone else. Yeah, no, there's someone else that used to work with us, but is on maternity leave. And I think they're coming back to work with us soon. Gotta find out their name before they start working again, so at least I look like I knew their name beforehand. Because they remembered my name, and I feel bad for that. Like, them remembering my name, but I don't remember their name, like. Landing back in Underberg is like playing a... S it is, honestly. Like, fucking... It's been the bane of my existence. If there was a... If there were stats that divided up, like, the time I've spent in each area, Underberg would be top. And then I think here now in Frontier, it'd be actually second. Why am I doing this? There you go. It'd be second place for the most time spent. And then for, like, the Black Fortress or whatever above, that would probably be, like, the least time spent, like... But yeah, I'm looking forward to the day I actually get out of here, though. I know you said something there, just give me- FUCK! Ah, just give me a second. Yeah, okay, no, I botched it. Have you fallen, uh, Frontier to Castle yet? Black Santa is so hard. Um, oh wow, okay. Gee, I look away just to try and, like, read, because I know I'm going down anyway, but I didn't think I'd go down this far. I've fallen down from Frontier, yeah, to Castle. Definitely. I was gonna say, the worst I probably fell was probably from... It was probably from... Uh, uh, just... Oh yeah, technically the area there in the middle is part of that, isn't it? The castle. But no, I've fallen farther than that. I've fallen basically near down to like the... I think it was like a snowy part of the... Um, whatchamacallit, the castle. Um, whatchamacallit, yeah, no, I, I remember once I fell down to the snow, and then I fell down the side, and I missed the jump for the ice, and I fucking slid down the ice and went all the way back down into the snow, and I was just done. I, that, that day, I, I had lost something I was never gonna get back, like. There's a part of me that just got buried in the snow, like. Um, whatchamacallit. Uh, I have fallen from thing, black down so hard, speaking of which... Speaking of which... Yes, I'm jumping over here. That's how impatient I am. Oh, my impatience is... Okay, it's not the enemy. I thought it was going to be the enemy. Actually, now that I see that, let me just... There you go. Um, Yeah, I've done the same thing multiple times. Yeah. To be fair, though, in Black Anthem, I don't think I was doing too bad. I think there was one really good run where I just fucking said, fuck it, I'm just gonna jump and see what happens, and it actually went really well. God, I gotta keep, like... Because OBS is just being a bit weird. Oh, I fucked it. Okay, it's not that bad. This map made me hate the number 5.26. 5.26? What is that in reference to? Oh, no, no! Okay, no, we're good, we're good. We're balling. Why do you hate the number? Is there any particular reason for it? I'm assuming there is a reason. Oh my god. The first no screen is 5.26%. Oh, so... Is that how much of the map it takes up, or am I being stupid here? Because most likely I am just being dumb, and I apologize. My brain's trying to, like, boot itself up to play this and respond properly. There we go. I put the new 4Gs on the G. I drive into the bloody bottoms out of Neve. Cause all my homies got it out on the streets. Cat nonsense. Where's the cat coming into the equation? I, uh, I'm not going to lie to you, I don't really see a cat now. How are you doing anyway, Amelia? 
Because I get your name probably wrong for the 1500 time in a row. But then again, that's just like the guy at work I was talking about earlier. Like, like there's so many different variants that you could call him, but I think I do remember it now. Ooh. That was toasty. And I would be toasty if I didn't have this fan on right now. Genuinely like a heat death box right now. Because I have my window closed. My PC fucking is hot as fuck. Even like with the cover on the so like side cover off of it. To give it a bit more air. Oh my god. I do be Oh my god. Okay, never mind. I was gonna say I believe in myself, I don't really anymore. Nah, yeah, I don't believe in myself enough. Oh, this is weird. I I don't like being this side. Oh, oh wait, okay, we got that. I've never- I don't- That's probably the first time in, like, the last 20 hours of me playing the game that I've actually been able to do that. Or jump from that side, because I don't think I've ever done that too much before. I say 20 hours, but yeah, in all the hours I've played the game. Oh my god. I should really just like close my eyes and just let the muscle memory just take over. Okay, no, I, <laughs> I almost just went off the edge there. Maybe I won't entirely trust muscle memory. Oh my god. At the very least, I want to make it to the moss section. And I say this now, right? I'm going to end it like when I reach the moss section, but I guarantee you I won't. There's no shot I'll actually like just end it when I reach the moss section. Unless there's another game I want to play. Oh my fucking god. My impatience is honestly getting the better of me in this. That's why like I keep failing so much. And doubt as well. Yeah, see, that's doubt. Yeah, I'll take that. Thank you. Thank you. Watch a master at play. If I fall now, I have to restart my game. Then I have to delete my save. God, if I ever were to do that. To be honest, actually, that would just give me a better looking time, <laughs> to be honest, if I had to do that, like. That should definitely be, like, a... Well, it's not really a good follower goal, is it, like? Basically me just setting my time to a different thing, like. Unless I had to start again from the very start of Jump King, then that, that's different. Okay, you know what? Overconfidence is not that bad. For that part, anyway. Oof. Notice how I just stood still, because I was just like, nah, I'm just, there's just no way I'm making it, like. Yeah, I'm sorry. I'm gonna go silent every time I get, <laughs> like, past that fucking jump, like. Ugh. Oh. Right. Not too close to thing. Go back. You think with the amount of hours I've poured into this map I'd like be able to do it, but nah. There's something wrong with my little head, like. Oh for fuck's sake. At least I'm making pro oh. At least I was making progress. Even if it's just minimal. And as I'm going to keep bringing up just like every stream, it's the fucking geometry dash effect. Because this, this kind of monotony just reminds me of that when I was younger. Like bro, I actually snapped at my ma like for distracting me while I was on the geometry dash fucking level like... Oh, but nah. I treated it way too seriously back then. 
Oh, for fuck's sake. Like, look at that, man. Okay, to be fair, at least I was let off there. You know, actually, weird story. A fucking fella talked to us recently because I was waiting for a bus at one time. And, like, I don't know why. He said I had an American accent. Like, do I have an American accent? Maybe it was just the way I was talking to him. I think it's like when I present myself to somebody I don't know, I probably have a different cadence to my voice or something like that. But that was probably the first time I've ever been told I had an, an American accent, I think. Oh, God. Oh, okay, we're good. No, wait, no, no, no! Okay, we're good, we're good, we're good. Whew. What other news do I have? Sherry Arbor Story Volume 17. No, uh, Update 17 is out. Uh, D3 is out. New Sherry Arbor Story video tomorrow. New normal video out. Oh my god! No! It's fucking- This is a rookie mistake. And I just committed it twice. Anyway, other than that, um, there's an actual new video tomorrow. Finally, the Mandela catalog will see the light of day again. Or at least half the VOD will, because the other VOD is still not edited yet. But I was like, you know what, fuck it, it's, it's long enough for its own video, I might as well, like. Um, Lazy Panda starts streaming again. Uh, Twitch is reintroducing 7030, even though it's not really going to be useful for anyone that has, like, Basically, if you're like 0.1% of Twitch, like, that's the only use case you'll have for it. Like, that's the only people that'll be applicable to. Uh, let's see. I'm trying to dig around my brain, just my cranium, for some, like, juicy positivity news. I just remember, though, on fucking Twitter, like, the moment, like, Twitch announced it, Kick just, like, reply to them just saying like we're still 95.5 like oh yeah that's it twitch band multi-streaming so even if i want to to attempt to like stream on multiple platforms i can that's uh that, that's good you know that's very consumer friendly i i know as well when it comes to ninja he actually had to say like okay i, I have to just cut twitch off like because like you know he's already streaming on everything else anyway like he's not just going to stream solely on twitch when, like, he has viewers from all, like, different platforms. But I swear, he works on a different level, though. Like, he's fucking... Like, he's got so many different, like... Like, it's not even funny how many he has, like... For me, it'd be, like, oh, maybe just three, like, kick YouTube, Twitch. But, like, obviously now I can't do that because of multi-streaming. If I ever wanted to, obviously. Um, but Ninja has, like, probably those three. TikTok, Facebook Gaming... I won't be surprised if he has some other one that like nobody's heard of. Maybe Rumble as well. I think Rumble's another uh, competitor. I think it's meant to be a YouTube competitor more than anything, though. On oh, the fucking news about fucking XQC being bought, well, not even being bought, but like basically have a little bit of a contract with Kit to stream um, for two years for a hundred like mil. Like, bro. Okay, like that's that's wh where the fuck money? Hello? Not even Twitch could afford that. Like. I guess that's what gambling money does, to be honest. Um, I learn all the Twitch news from Ludwig. Yeah, I watched that today too, yeah. I Like, for me, it's between, like, whoever... Well, whoever, I guess, I click on first. It's between Ludwig and, um... Uh, probably Moist Critical, like, and all that. I just seen, like, his video on it. I was like, what the fuck? But yeah, no, and he did it, and he fucking, like... Because he's, like, first time streaming on the platform, the fucking platform went down, I think, for, like, five hours. Or at least that's what I was seeing from the tweets. They're like, we'll get the platform back up soon. It was, like, five hours until they got it back, like. Oh, my God. Oh, no, no, keep going. It's cool. You know, actually, I'll, I'll help you out with going down. There you go. Too much. Uh, more than LeBron James. Like, I, I'm not even much into the sports scene, but even I know who, Le Le like, LeBron James is, man. Or at least I've definitely heard of him before. <laughs> but it is mad. He's, like, what is it, the second most or third most um, contracted sports player? Even though, like, it's a bit of a stretch to call him a sports player, but, like, even then, like, it's still a lot. Like, 100 mil is no joke, and, like, he's also getting that 95, like, 5 split on kick as well, like. 
Like, you don't think he's probably already, like... Even if 100 mil was somehow not enough to him, like, fucking... All that, like, um, kick, like, subscription revenue is just madness, like. And plus, he can advertise on his stream with sponsors if he really needed them. And, like, he wouldn't get fucking banned for it. Like, on Twitch, that's gonna probably happen at the end of the month. Oh my god, no, I'm, I'm gonna fall to the ice and I'm gonna cry. Yeah, no, it's over. <laughs> and he can gamble too, finally. The content we've been waiting for from the main juicer himself. Fuck, how did I get up here again? See, this is- oh my god, it's been so long since I've been down here, I don't even remember how to do it. Okay, there we go. Oh yeah, I forgot, I need to fucking catch myself back because of the ice. Oh yeah, and. Right, anyway, let's keep going. Ah, fuck! Okay. Oh, yeah, for I forgot I can just jump straight up. Man, this is actually- it's, it's actually weirdly nostalgic to be down here, to be honest. It's just like, I I haven't been down here in so long, like, it's gonna be interesting to see how long it takes me to get back up. Why am I doing that? What are, what are you doing?! Okay, down to the snow I go soon. Two clicks, Joe. Oh, excuse me. Too much. Yeah, I knew it. I was on too much of a good streak to not fuck that up, honestly. Two clicks, Joe. One, two. Fuck, no, that's too much. Back a bit. The only snow I should be touching is at the bottom of this ice level. If I didn't have the timer, we could st <laughs> pretend this is a speedrun. Hey guys, welcome back to speedrun. Today we'll be speedrunning Jump Kings, the second map. Definitely didn't just fall a shit ton and just decided to make a video out of it. Make sure to like, comment, and subscribe for more speedruns on the YouTube channel. So let us get into it. Oh my god. Ah. With potential like this, how did he fuck up so badly? As I struggle to get back up here, like... There we go. See, honestly though, Jump King is not even hard. Look, watch, watch, watch this shit. <laughs> honestly, at this point, I'm just laughing at my own misery, because I know I'm not going to be able to get back to where I really want to be in a while. No, what do you... Where are you aiming at? Where are you aiming at? Oh, well, I don't even know why I jumped that way. I mean, to be fair... Oh yeah, no, I could have just jumped this way. Oh my god, okay. I don't even really play Fortnite that much, but I seen... I was just looking through the Epic Store, just to see what was free and claiming free games. And I seen that like Fortnite finally added um, Transformers. I was surprised to see that they were short though. Basically same like height and all that as the player but it, it does make a lot more sense though because like how are you going to really sell like Transformer stuff and not have them be the um, size of the players you know. 
Nope, this way. I'd be disappointed if they didn't have any vehicles in the game that, like, at least resemble the Transformers themselves. <laughs> oh. No way, they teased the Transformers back in, like, 20... Like, 17, bro. No way. And they're finally in the game. It still is weird to just see how, like, Fortnite are still pulling all these big, like, collabs with different stuff. And then Bungie's just like, oh yeah, we're doing a collab with, like, a gacha game, but it's like, um... You know, we, we don't get any content at all, but they get to make a whole, like, story segment in their game about Destiny. Oh my god, please. Okay, you know what? Fine. We'll, we'll stay here. I think that's thunder. Hold on. Oh, and actually, let me turn on the light. I just realized how dark it's getting. Sorry if my model was like stuck for a while and I didn't even fix that. There we go. Yeah, that's not looking nice at all. I think I might have even caught a little glimpse of a flash there. So uh, if the stream suddenly stops, it's because I've been electrocuted live. That's one way to go out from streaming. But yeah, no, I'm definitely not leaving. I was thinking of leaving my window open, but I'm like, that's kind of a dumb idea. I'm not gonna do that, like... Not whilst it's like... Basically thunderstorm outside right now. But yeah, uh, oh yeah, the fucking Father's Day event. I love the way I was like, yeah, no, I'll probably do that, but then I just ended up not really doing it. I don't know, I just... Meh. Maybe, like, if I do stream tomorrow, I'll change the, um, scroll bar to blue or something like that. Or maybe even have a little, um, thing on my head saying, like, Oh, yeah, I could have a little post-it note that says Happy Father's Day. Because for, like, International Women's Day, I had a little post-it note on my head that said Happy International Women's Day. If you die in stream, you get infinite views. No way. Maybe I should try that. Nah, I'm joking. Jesus Christ. I mean, to be fair, that would be, like, fucking viral, wouldn't it? <laughs> now, not that I'd actually fucking do it, to be fair. Like, I'm bit... No, shush. It's just a funny concept, like... Because we're talking about my death. If it's someone else, then that's different. We, we, don't re we won't really talk about that too much. The comeback. The comeback is real. For the laws, I actually should just start watching One Piece and literally just watch it like a few episodes a day. Like, I won't be that one guy that my mate said that watched it in like fucking two weeks because that's what the fuck is that? How? And that was ages ago, though, so there, there, there wasn't a thousand episodes, so it was probably only, like, 900, like. But, um, yeah, no, but just based off, like, the first, uh, manga that I have of it, like, I probably would like One Piece, to be honest. It's just the amount of episodes is just too daunting, like, to watch. Unless I just read One Piece. Whichever is faster, honestly. Oh, my God, that was so close, man. Oh, literally made it and fucking walked off. Good job. My brain actually can't, like my, there's a gear in my head that's fucking aching right now. It's like, what, how the fuck did you do that? See, that makes sense, but how did I legit walk off after landing it? Like, absolutely no way did I just do shit like that, man. too much. I could tell, honestly. There's just some times where, like, when I hold down the space bar, I just know, like, that, for example, well, to be fair, I saw that more than anything. But, like, the last one I did, I just did a bit too much of, and that's too much as well. 
Okay, no, please, thank you. <laughs> They're giving me mercy. I, I do appreciate that. But now, now that I say that, though, they've fucking chucked me down multiple times, and that's not really nice. Chuck me down to nearly the snow section. Unless that little ice part at the bottom does count snow, but I'm pretty sure the name changes, like, once you go from snow to the ice section, so... We'll just say it's the ice section. You know, just because, you know, before I keep going up, I have to just, you know, go back to the old area and just, you know, reminisce and, like, reminisce, sorry, of the, um, old times. It'd be a shame if I didn't. Another reason I want to beat the game as well is because I just, I, I do kind of like that feeling you get when you do beat the whole game, like. So I still, I, like, I still remember the clip in my head now and how I reacted. I was saying, yeah, there's like, no way, oh. There's a flash. Um, oh, I didn't even, oh, I must have moved that. Wait, hold on, that's gonna annoy. Ooh, that thunder was heavy. Ooh, that thunder was heavy. I don't know if you hear that at all, but. Where's the jump king? Just move it over a little bit like this, I think. No, there's a little bit of a thing just here. Is that better? I can't tell if that's better. No, there's still like a bit on the out, this thing. We can't hear it. Yeah, no, it's it's like, it's more rumbly than loud anyway. And when it's a mix of two sections, it's the bottom one that uh, it counts for. Yeah. Hold on, I just want to... I think that should be it. Sorry, I just seen like a little line just going like down the right hand side. Yeah, no, I think it's fixed now. I must have moved it unintentionally. Maybe I should. Well, actually. I, I mean, to be fair, I already have a light on, so like. Oh. What happened? I don't. I looked over to me and I thought I was ragdolling there for a minute, like. Um. Yeah, maybe I should close the blinds, but. Eh. At least I'll know every time when lightning strikes. And I'll know when I go- oh, Literally jumped! The, the fucking world's tiniest jump by accident, and it did that to me. Oh, oh what are you doing? <sighs> okay, now I can jump, finally. Ah, <sighs> that's good to hear. Oh, right. Um, there is nothing better, though, than when you start your summer vacation, like, regardless of how long it is. Because for that time, you kind of just get to relax and do what you want. To be fair, though, I do know there are some times during my summer holidays when I had them initially, like, when I was getting bored, but, like, I think I soon found stuff to do. Even without much contact from uh, friends and stuff. I wish I kept in better contact though. Because even now, like, I'm like basically going out with my mates every so often. They're like, oh, why didn't we do this a lot when we were younger? It's like, I don't know. And uh, Underberg, help you with. Ah, uh, we'll see. Well, I say we'll see, but I most likely will fall again, so. You can put the advice in as I come across them. Unless I go speeding past the section, I've already passed it. There we go. Nah, I won't be able to go up higher, I don't think. So if I full jump there, it would just hit off you. Bet. Treasure your free time. To be fair though, if, I can't really say too much about me, myself, and my job, like, anyway, because, um... Because I only work, like, three days, ba well, not even three days, basically two and a bit days, anyway. But I do know, if I had a full-time job, I would miss so much having free time. But I don't mind just sacrificing those, um, two days for a means of, like, basically earning money, you know? And I'm not really in a rush to earn a lot of money, so, like... That's why I still only have one part-time job. I have been thinking, though, of getting another part-time job. Just not yet, though. But I did say it to my dad this morning, where it's like, um... If I was to get another part-time job, it would have to be, like, opposite my current job. 
So I do one part-time job at the start of the week and one on the other end of the week. And then eventually I would transition uh, with the other part-time job to go into a full-time job and then start doing that more than the other job. Because I do feel like with my current place, like it's a nice place and all, but I think once I'm, um, once it's like August, I think I'm going to reevaluate if I want to stay at the place or not. Because I only really started working in my current workplace because I needed somewhere to like start working. And at least like if you have a starting point where you first worked, that's good references that could be used later on when you're finding um, uh, more work. Oh, uh, last screen is careful jump. Uh, oh, of Underberg, yeah. If I do fall back down there, okay, yeah, I'm gonna fall back. No, I'm not gonna fall back down there just yet. If I do fall back down there, I'm gonna. Oh no, I think I know the one you're talking about, but I do kind of prefer the one where it's just like a little jump. Because the other one I'm just not used to, but that one I am more used to. Oh, for fuck's sake. Yeah, that's just a little glimpse into my psyche and where I'm at right now. Right, Q in a slot of hole. Uh, which way was it again? This way. Too much. I did it again. I did the exact same mistake that I did last time. Yeah, so I can't full send that one. I was almost there though. Literally, if the thing appeared, that means I was... Oh my god, Jesus, okay. Fucking throw me down the end then. If I didn't full jump that, I would be up there by now. But it's good to know I can actually reach there. There is hope in the universe after all. Um, but yeah. And the only reason I really talk about that sort of stuff anyway is just to get it off my mind, like, just so it's out there. And I actually hear myself say it and I'm seeing if I have to doubt myself on it or not. That seems like a sound enough plan anyway. Unless I, like, I for some reason need, like, desperately need money, then the plan would be carried out a lot faster. But, like, I've basically just learned in life, like, there really isn't any rush, like. That's why Sherry Albert's story isn't out yet. That's why I don't stream all the time and I just kind of chill. I do worry a lot about not doing so for my time, but there's also good... It's good to just have downtime, you know? Uh, on the very bottom of the left screen, the wind uh, moving right, left, full, bonk. I'm trying to remember... Oh, God. Ah, oh, the way! Okay. Left screen. I don't know what you mean by left screen, to be honest. I think that's the part that's tripped me up the most. Last screen, sorry, yeah. Oh, yeah, okay. I'll, I'll give it a shot anyway and see how it goes. I think I know the exact jump you're on about. Man, wouldn't it be a miracle if I could jump into that little hole again? Oh, no. No, come on. There you go. I jumped into up here before. That, like, entrance there. But that was when I ruled the world. As you can see, I have no crown. And I thought I was going to yeah, die. That's why I did thing. And panicked. Literally for this section, it's more of just, like, I wish the wind would change more often, like... I think obviously they made it slow on purpose, so you have to take your time, like. So it's here, and then when it starts, with the wind moving right, let, full left bonk. That's it, yeah. If that becomes more successful, I'll probably do it more often. I'm glad I understood that, honestly. So I was just like ridiculing myself recently in another video about not being able to fucking speak English properly. It's good to say I have some intelligence still intact to me, like. Let me jump up. Uh, here, did you know old Paddy there could speak Chinese? How so? Or what is that quote from? Oh, for fuck's sake. 
You know, actually, I know the way, like, I know that, like, Paddy and Patty and all that is actually a stereotypical, like, name for an Irish guy that you just talk about. But, like, there was actually a guy in our class that we would call Paddy, like... I don't know if I'm about to say something that I shouldn't, but it's Adam Dumb means that's their name. I see. I think. I don't know if I should walk into it or not. So I'll choose not to. I'll play it safe. The only thing I'll be confident about is, um, I'm not even confident in even, like, saying it because I can't remember it properly, is the Bing Shiling, like, copy-paste. And it's basically only the first part of it, like. To be fair, though, I'd actually have to see it to, like, try to say it again. Zhang Xie Hao. Well, your Bing Shiling. Well, thanks to your Bing Shiling. De Shu. I like John Cena, man. Wait, didn't he, like, um, play a hero or something in a film or a series or something? Oh, what was it called again? Uh, fucking... I think his name was Peacekeeper in it. Or is that actually the name of the show? That might just be the name of the show. You know, I think, uh, like, even when I had the, um, whatchamacallit, the... Uh... Even when I had the... I, it's like one of the WWE games. Like, John Cena was always the guy I'd pick for it. Like, I don't even know why. I think it was just because he had, like, the highest stats or some shit like that. In one of the games. But then, I think he did, like, a movie with, um... Evan Lee's as well or something like that. I think he played as, like, Evan Lee's father or something like that. I can't remember. But it was something on that lines, like... You know, honestly, I don't know if I do like the timer at the top corner. It's just like... How do I... Oh, yeah, I have to exit, don't I? Hold on. I have clocked 50 hours! Holy shit, man. That's mad. I've spent- I've wasted fi- Well, to be fair, 50 hours is nothing compared to my fucking Destiny time. That I should not be proud of at all. Like, if, if you go to- what is it? Um, time wasted in Destiny or something like that. Oh yeah, sorry, I forgot about the thing. If I go to time wasted or yeah, if you go to time wasted in Destiny and look up like Joe's Knife Flyer or something like that, or it might be the Knife Flyer, like you'll see that I've wasted a stupid amount of time in Destiny Two. Of course, I'd spend more time in Destiny Two than Destiny One because I literally cannot play Destiny One anymore because I don't have a Xbox or a PlayStation to play it on. I kind of wish I did though. I kind of wish I did just buy that PlayStation from um, which is probably from GameStop. Just so we could play Destiny 1 again. Play it from like the very beginning. But to be fair at this point, like a lot of the content from Destiny 1 is basically already in Destiny 2 anyway, like. Because Bungie can't make new content as much, like. They have the under deliver and all that sort of shit. The game I have the most hours in is Mario Maker 2. That kind of makes sense though, doesn't it? Like it's... Like I've seen a load of videos like back in the day of like... Mario Maker 2 and how good it was. And, like, it's just basically seemingly infinite, like, the amount of levels people can just make, like. I know, I think at some point, Game Theory was like, oh, there's this amount of, like, things you can make. But at that point, like, you might as well just say it's basically infinite, like. Okay, let's see if I can actually make it up here. Oh, for fuck's sake. No! Stop, stop. Okay. Um, Because I don't play many games. I'm trying to, re uh, to recreate all three Jump King maps. What, in fucking Mario Maker? Like, bro. That's an objective and a half. 
that kind of reminds me of my lofty goals and how I'd literally just start building them a little bit and then just give up afterwards. Like, like when I uh, said I was going to like rebuild the um, prison from Sky Does Minecraft's um, Cops and Robbers series. Oh, for fuck's sake, I walked off on that. Um, and then like I literally just built one prison cell and I was like, grand, this is a... Uh, this, this, this would be too tough to do, so I'm not going to do it. But yeah. So there's a lot of springs and you aren't allowed to face left. There's a lot of springs and you aren't allowed to face left. I'm not sure what... Oh, the, yeah, okay. No, I, I get it now, yeah. I, I guess, yeah, no, I see how that would work. Oh my god, I keep instinctively getting back up here and I'm scared I'm going to do thing to myself. There we go. Uh, and they are vertical levels that get progressively harder. So instead of the um, horizontal way. But then again, it's vertical, isn't... God, I always get them mixed up because fucking... Something at one point or another actually started confusing me. Like, vertical? Horizontals across verticals up and down. People spend hours on each level. I guess that's a good thing, in a sense. You've just, like, crafted really good levels that people are actually spending a lot of time trying to, like, complete them, like. Oh, for fuck's sake. No! Okay, no, the game, game. Let's go, let's go. I gotta stop instinctively, like, trying to... Oh. I gotta stop instinctively trying to catch myself on ledges when I'm not in the wind section. Because it's so unnecessary. Like, I don't need to catch myself. Unless I'm, like, slipping on ice or something like that. Just give me a second. Too much. Too much. Right. Uh, it's my only level, which tells me... Tells me it's just, like, jump game. Oh yeah, <laughs> it's just like, if they're spending that much time on that, then you've made a good replica of Jump King. The only thing I kind of joked about making at one point, and continued making it, has to be like Sherry Arbor's story for me. It was literally just meant to be a fucking like, kind of throwaway little gag about, oh what if like this particular uh, thing happened in Jokes Night Flyers kind of universe, but then I was like, Wait, this actually might work. And then I fucking wrote a volume about it. And I kept writing volumes about it. And now I'm on, like, volume 17, like... I'm trying to actually, like, publish it at one stage whenever I actually get around to finishing editing it again, like... I need to divide my, the maps into four different levels for it to work, so it's basically... Jump King with checkpoints. Ah, yeah, at least you're working around the limitations and you're not letting it stop you, you know? But I mean, after like making a section of the game, you wouldn't really stop there. Like, you'd still probably publish it as it is anyway. Like, especially after like all the hard work you'd probably put into that. Like, yeah, that was like the other option as well in GameStop. I could have bought a Nintendo Switch and just started playing a load of Nintendo games. But for some reason, I just when it comes to me and buying a console again, it's just weird. I think it's like. Ever since I popped onto PC, I've just thought, like, what's the point of... I guess in the back of my mind, there must be a thing that's saying, like, what's the point in the consoles when I have a PC? Because it's like, when I still had an Xbox, I still had... Or I had, um... A DSi, I think it was, or DS Lite or something like that. A 3DS. And my brother has, like, a Switch now, so, like, clearly, like... When I was a console lover, I still loved other consoles, like, but now I'm on PC, I'm like, damn, should I bother with this? But to be fair, there's also this, like, excuse of, like, at some point Nintendo are going to release, like, another new console soon. So maybe it's just better to wait and see if the new console can do backwards compatible stuff, and if it can't, then buy a Switch. When they get cheaper. Um, have you seen videos uh, of this map, or have you been playing through blind? I remember seeing a speed run, but it wasn't of the entire map. It was just to a section where I got to when I was just looking at where um, certain skips could be used, if I could replicate them, basically. 
that's probably the extent of me seeing other Jump King content. Other than that, though, I've just listened to Sea Dog VA, like, I think, play all three maps and custom maps and all that sort of thing. Oh, wait, I won't jump. See, I knew I was going to do that. Um, I guess essentially I'm playing it blind. Because, like, yeah, no, that's really it, actually. There's not much else to add towards the answer. There's no need to blow it up unnecessarily. I think even if I did see the whole map, I still would fucking... I'd still be here for a long time anyway, like, it wouldn't really make much of a difference, like... It would just be... Oh, gee, I could hear that outside. Um, but I could, like, um... Basically, I'd still struggle. I can't remember my train of thought, so I'm just gonna say I'll still struggle, like... Fuck, I'm doubting myself. Dude. Like, that's not totally radical. That's like a no-go. <sighs> I was seriously so close to thing, man. And it, it's weird how I'm not too annoyed by it, but at the same time, I should be, like, pissed off at that. That I was literally there. I was literally nearly in the Mountain King's um, area. It is Mountain King, is it? It's not Moss King. The, um, not Badger, the Mole. I think he was a Mole, anyway. Yeah, and honestly, that full jump is probably better than the other jump, to be honest. Because at least, like, with a full jump, you can barely go wrong with it. That's why I think full jumps are more, like, used by people than uh, smaller jumps. If you can full jump something instead of small jumping it, then, like, the risk of actually losing that jump is, like, lessened. Oh, for fuck's sake. Okay, thank god I'm here. But yeah, I'm actually looking forward, though, to seeing what video I edit next for, um, the channel. Because I've been on, a, like, a video editing streak recently. Last three days I've edited four videos. When it's, like, taking me ages to think. But to be fair though, with the, um, with the, not Mandela catalog, with the Backrooms video, it's like, that was being kind of worked on over time as I chop up the footage. That's probably the part that, like, actually deters me from editing, is just the fact that I have to, like, chop up the fo- oh, for, okay, I guess I'll just do it this way for once. Um, that's what deters me from editing, it's just, it takes so long to watch like VODs, even when I speed them up a little bit, but then like if I speed them up too much I won't be able to catch if I say something stupid or funny like or if some moment happens in the actual like VOD itself but that's why I started to turn to streaming I basically got lazy and I was like, oh what if I just uploaded full recordings as they were like and there's nothing wrong with this honestly, I do like the like the interactive aspect of uh, doing thing. I've jumped the wrong way. I thought he was laughing at me for a minute. I'm like, bro, you haven't even tried to jump up here, fella. Stop staring at that statue, like. Oh, for f no, please, please. I know. What okay, it's not that bad. It's actually kind of sad that I have to say that that's not that bad after dropping down from so high, like. Oh, for f okay, now it's bad. Yeah, I think that's why I'm getting into the editing mood again. Okay, fuck me over, why don't you? Just let me be silent for a moment so I can actually do this. That's why I'm in the editing mood again. It's just like, it's been so long since I've properly, like, edited, started editing videos that, like, it just feels nice to edit videos again, honestly. And there are, like, a load of VODs that I do want to edit, like, at some point or another. Like, it's a very lofty goal, but I'd love to edit the entirety of, like, the uh, Terraria series so far with me and Lazy Panda. Because some of the shit, like, we said during that is just so gas, like. Oh, okay, wait, there you go. Like, it's so gas that I even took a moment from it and just, like, posted it as its own clip, like. And that's another reason to start editing again, is actually to get more clips, like. Sometimes I just amuse myself. With editing, and I think that's the important thing. 
to find fun in the thing you're working on and working with. That's why I, I think I enjoyed editing during certain periods of time. But then if you look back to like the Doki Doki Literature Club and Five Nights at Freddy's Security Breach times, like sure I probably had my moments of fun editing them, but like those I was just pumping out pretty fast like and then I got bored eventually after a while like editing the series because it it can just get monotonous sometimes but then there's like the um like for the ddlc one ddlc plus i edited it like a good bit at the start part way through then it just turned into me chopping up moments and putting them into a video and then like slowly over time i just started actually adding like different bits of editing in again but yeah Oh, for fuck's sake. Oh, okay. We're good. What I'd like to do as well, I think, like, the next big editing project should be the, um, FNAF Security Breach Ruin DLC. Just because, like, the FNAF Security Breach, um, movie VOD theme of Bob did pretty well. I say VOD, but it's more of a... I took, like, every video that was edited down and I just put it into one, like, uh, video. I mean, it did pretty well, though. 50, like, 3k views. I, I can't say that's not bad. Like, for a channel with 200 subs, like. But yeah, I should... Maybe I should go back and edit the security breach VODs as well. And then make a... Just make another one of it. The exact same one. Just before, like, Ruin comes out. And then when Ruin comes out, I start recording it. I don't know if I'm actually going to record that or I'm going to stream it. I might record it again. And then if it really becomes monotonous, I could just <laughs> pretend it's a VOD and just upload it as a VOD, like. Yeah, no. I, I guess at this point I'm just reminiscing on the past, because, like, there are some things I've left behind over time on YouTube and all that, but, like, there are some things I want to bring back, like. Just to get a bit of, uh, variety back in. I can't guarantee to myself, though, that- oh god. I can't guarantee to myself that I'm actually going to edit another video tomorrow, but I would love to though. At least edit like one more video tomorrow, because it's Sunday. And then, um, you know, once I go back to work, I think that's when I'll be kicked out of my streak again of uh, editing videos. If anything though, more importantly, I should be getting back into editing Sherry Arbor's story more. I need to get like the actual like preview for Sherry Arbor's story done soon. It's just, again, this ties back into the whole point of, um, taking my time with things. And that's how much time I've been taking. I just, I don't have, like, deadlines for anything, like. Until something, like, maybe releases as a new, in the, like, limelight, that's kind of like a deadline upon itself, but other than that, like, there's not really much t uh, deadlines that I need to do thing for. Anyway, I rambled. I probably should stop talking and actually take a deep breath, like. And it'd be nice if I took a bit of water. <clears throat> I gotta look at, like... I know, um... Nags21 does this thing called, like, Endurance Weeks. I should probably look into doing something like that. Where, like, just for a full week, I literally just... Sit down, and I stream for as long as I can, and we go from there. <laughs> and you know the game I choose for that. Is my teeth bleeding? I swear I taste blood unless I'm just tasting something else. Nah, no, I think it's something else. That was weird. I just got a weird sensation that I was tasting blood there for a minute. To be fair, I'm already talking about my like, teeth bleeding. <laughs> like, I'm, I'm like, oh yeah, and we'll do an endurance week as well. We'll see how long we last in Jump King before I literally break my keyboard in half. Hopefully my mouse is okay, because honestly it's... When it was plugged into parts, different parts of the computer, it wasn't acting that well, but it might actually just be my computer. And if it's my computer, that's probably a bigger problem, because then that means I need to get the, um, motherboards, USB, well, actually, not even just the USB, just the whole thing replaced at that point, which, which is not really cheap. So at that point, I probably just go into making a new PC, but I just don't know where to start. Because when I made my PC, I based it off my friend who based it off his friend's PC. No, wait, no. 
I think it was... I based that off my friend's 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 PC. That's it. I think it's triple. I don't think it's double. But that second friend is also my friend as well. But the third friend isn't. The last one. So I wouldn't know where to start. And I don't really want to, like... I could just order, like, a customized PC already. But I mean, I, I could I just, I could save money. There probably is a tutorial for it on YouTube, because, like, when I was building my PC, there was a tutorial, eh, tutorial for it. Um, for when I was building mine, so. And I have a vague understanding of how a PC's built, because I built one, like, three years ago at this point. And, of course, even if I replace my PC, I wouldn't exactly entirely just say, like, it'd be pointless to, um... Or I wouldn't exactly say, oh, yeah, that's old PC. Throw it away. <laughs> just, just completely dumped. Nah, I'd probably still keep it in my room. Because I still keep my, um... Computer I bought when I was in college. Which, the c computer that I have on the floor now... Was actually the reason my... Or why this current PC I have now was delayed. Because I was, um... Like, I needed a PC to do college stuff, and I keep doing that way again. But, um... Yeah. It's weird to think, though. If that, like... If the current PC that's on the floor right now, the white one, if that didn't come around, I probably would have gotten a gaming PC sooner through any... Like, a different means, basically. Because beforehand, I was doing YouTube and all that on a laptop, like... And I started from the bottom, now I'm here. And now I have, like, actual work money that I can use to <laughs> just get a whole new PC if I really wanted to. If anything, though, I'd love to get a PC that, like, I can guarantee will work with VR. I think my PC might be able to work with it, because it does have a VR-ready, like, port on it. I've just never bothered to actually invest in a VR headset. Which maybe I should. Even if I'm just sitting down for the game, like, it'd be great crack, like, just to play a VR game. Okay jump a bit more thank you because we can even just go back to like five nights of phrase uh, help wanted like that's a game that i have that's in vr i could finally like maybe actually look into playing the half-life series because uh, half-life alex is on vr as well if only if like playstation weren't like snobby about their like vr headset and actually allowed you to plug it into a pc or anything else for that matter and then it's just mad to think about that Xbox don't even do one in general. I think PlayStation are trying to do a portable thing as well, but I don't think it's going to work the same as a PSP or a PS Vita. God, I don't know what the fuck's wrong with me. Jesus, I, I just started rambling and rambling, and then I said I'd stop rambling, and I just kept rambling, like... Yeah. I guess the reason I keep rambling on is because, like, there's nothing else to do other than just do the same motion over and over and over again. And then hope I do better the next time round when I actually get to the point of, uh, back in the moss and all that. What time are we I am not good on time. I sure be Jays, we still have time, Darno. What are we in? We're, we're only an hour into stream, like, we still have another, like, two hours at least, like. <laughs> That's like insanity talk. How- wait, how did I even fail that? Actually, I shouldn't even ask at this point. It's fucking Jump King. Like, things are bound to just happen, like. Actually, this is important. I'm gonna check this right now. Did Panda refan- refund me on my points? I cried yesterday. I was at Honor Stream yesterday and I redeemed something. But, like, it didn't go through on the stream, and she even confirmed it herself. And she said, oh, yeah, I'll refund you at the end of the stream. I don't know if she actually did it or not. To be fair, though, I'm not too jazzed about it, but, like, I want to I'm just, I'm just curious. I'm just curious if we have a scam on our hands. I don't know how I think, yeah, no, if I do the pop-out chat. Okay, no, yeah, she did refund me, because I have, like, a K, uh, 1K teacups again. Lovely stuff. Thanks, Boo. There we go. Oh, yeah. It'd be nice if I actually swapped back to the game. Actually, how does the main scene look? It looks weird, to be honest. 
But like at the same time, the only reason I want to switch to this screen is because of the um Oh yeah, no wait, there's no timer at the top anymore, so I don't even need to. What am I waffling on about Leak? Monday left me broken, Tuesday I was through hoping, Wednesday my da 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 As bad as the meme is, the fucking song slaps, like... Any, like, music that becomes a meme is usually a banger, like... Except for that weird one where it's like the Reddit sex one or whatever. I think it was just dubbed the Reddit sex one because, like, it was just weird. Speaking of which, actually, I wonder if, like, most Reddit stuff is still down. Last I heard, I think Reddit were going to try and Bruce uh, force, like, some Reddit, subreddits back online. Which is just mad to think about, like. I honestly think at that point, like, you might as well just move platform. Like, I think apparently, like, 5% of the mods on Reddit actually do, um... Like, they own a lot of power on the uh, subreddits themselves, like. I feel like if they just banded together and just said to everyone, Yo, we're gonna make our own app, have fun, like. I think people would follow. Especially if it was more, like, advertised as well and they got streamers involved. Like, even just taking an app like Apollo, a third-party app, and just transforming it into Reddit, basically. Instead of just being a, like, third-party Reddit accessing app. I mean, Kick did it for, with Twitch, and like they're succeeding. Like, why can't they do it too? But yeah, no. The day that Kick actually does have um, downloadable vods is probably when I'll actually decide to stream more on Kick. But then again, at the like at the end of the month, I think I'm going to be flip flopping between pla like platforms quite a bit if they do actually go through with the advertisement changes. And if it does, like, heavily affect people as well. I think, like, for the first day of July, I should stream, um, on YouTube at the very least. And then go from there. One thing I still have neglected in life is getting a maiden. That is one thing that will always be neglected. I've no time to be searching for maidens. I have to complete Jump King within, like, the 35th hour. To be fair, though, I think I've said this before, but I'm always, like, not always, but I do kind of prefer the prospect of actually just meeting someone at random rather than just swiping them on a, a dating app. I'm a bit old-fashioned now. You can tell by my age that I'm old-fashioned. For fuck's sake, please, please! I'll wait. I'll be patient. Oh, shit, I was gonna fall. Thank you. <sighs> yeah, once FNAF Help Wanted 2 comes out, I have to continue Help Wanted if I can as well. And I also have to reveal something about Help Wanted as well. I can't really mention it now, just in case for some reason it comes true, but yeah. Yeah, I'm not gonna lie, you actually kind of scared me a bit, I'm not gonna lie. Welcome to the stream. Where pain and misery is my current motto. Because I have just been doing this for the last... Hour and ten minutes? So yeah. Four, f uh, four for four. Oh yeah, because the... Oh yeah, because the fucking... Yeah, I remember now the clip. The moment I read that, I was like, oh yeah, the fucking Minecraft clip. Okay, we're good. To be fair though, like, you, the sound alerts are a really good use on streams like these. When I'm legit trying to concentrate as hard as I can. Because you have the power to break my, co like, not confidence, but to break my, um, my concentration at any time. Yeah, pain. The weather's not looking too grand no, I'm not gonna lie to you. Oh, for fuck's sake. Nah, it's too little. Yay! And there goes the yeet.
Anyway, let's get back up. You know that's a problem when that doesn't even phase me anymore, like... When I'm not screaming and kicking my, like, heels against the fucking... Or bashing my heels. You know what I mean. When I'm not throwing a tantrum after dropping that low, that's when you know I've been through the, like, trenches here, like... Do blindfold one next, yeah? Oh yeah, obviously. We'll, we'll, we'll start that right now, right? Did I make it? I made it, okay. This <laughs> just... That was the quickest blindfold attempt there. To be fair though, like when I get up past this section, I do kind of like close my eyes for it. To try and stop myself making mistakes. Because it's a certain section where I know if I just full jump in certain directions, I know I'll make it every time. That's what happens when you get bored, you just start spamming the keys, like. I should have, like, that little Osu, like, um, keyboard. Oh, wait, my workplace kind of has something like that. Not an Osu keyboard, but, like, a little, like, number pad. I'll ask permission to be like, yes, boss, I would like, uh, this little keypad. Why, you may ask? For, um, gaming purposes, yes. Uses it for a late epic Osu gameplay. Where's the Twitch chat against you seven day stream? God, yeah, that was ages ago. I'd have to start that one back up as well at some point. Because now there's that and the, tw like, the fucking um, Terraria. <laughs> it's just both ideas already started, but like they're already dead. Like They're already dead in the water. Oh my god, fucking... I don't know if you remember like Foghorn. I think it was a rooster. A part of like the Looney Tunes. I've started seeing memes of him pop up recently. He's like, I say, I say, boy, why are you pissing in the middle of the night? Don't you know how loud you're pissing? Are you frying some chicken in there, boy? Why, I say, I say, boy. New Twitch stuff for seven days, too, with new update. Oh, that's cool. I, I thought they were literally just being like, oh, yeah, by the way, here's a shader change. <laughs> just, that's it. Not going to update much else. We haven't updated in a while, like. It's cool to see that they updated the Twitch shit as well. Maybe that's their plan. They're going to update the Twitch stuff as much as possible to get Twitch people to do it more, to, like, kind of advertise for the game. Which is smart. I probably would, like, do that as well, to be honest. Ah, we're good. We'll get back up. We'll get back up and be pissed right back down. Because it's currently raining in-game. When it goes gold, they'll start making it ready for console. Oh, cool. I didn't even... Oh, yeah, now that I think about it, it's been a while since they've, like, um... Updated the Xbox version, right? Because the Xbox one is, like, stuck in a, like, older build. It was ha Hail and Thunder. Gee, I didn't even know that. I just... I saw the flash of lightning and I heard the thunder. I didn't even see the hail. Don't mind me. Yeah. Just looking out for a thing. Probably would have melted anyway with the heat, like. It was weird one of those days when I was walking in the rain. It was just like warm rain. It kind of felt nice though, can't lie. Oh, for fuck's sake. Yeah, they were pea size and it felt like massage on my back. You're just out with a sunbed, just like, ah, oh, there we go. That hits the spot. Oh, okay, we're good. Oh yeah, I didn't even mention this about work yet, because I was talking about a bunch of different stuff about work and whatnot. But I've got to change my hours around soon. And I can't mention why on stream, but I can mention that my hours will probably change soon. Basically, I'm going to work less on Monday, Tuesday, and work longer on Wednesday. That's all I can really say. I mean, I was out in shorts and a t-shirt. Ah, oh, yeah, fair enough. Ah, uh, but sure, you still got a good massage, like. Good jump, good jump. Okay, just hold on one minute. Okay, it was serious gamer time there, but yeah. 
The reason um, I go silent up there is because, like, that's the best point I make it to before I actually nearly reach the top again. But yeah. Um, yeah, yeah, if I remember, I will. If I don't DM you later, I'll probably mention it later anyway. I'm just saying as in general anyway, because there are odd times where I'll stream on a Wednesday. But, like, I'm just letting everyone know that, like, in advance, like, I'm probably not going to be streaming as early on uh, Wednesdays anymore. Oh, there we go. I should have been more patient with that, but I was like, fuck it. What have I got to lose at this point except going all the way back down the bottom, like? Monday left me broken. Tuesday I was true with hoping. I put the new 4G's on the Jeep I drive into the bloody bottom that I need Cause all my homies got it out of the street My honey wrecks inside my jeans Oh yeah With a voice as perfect as mine, I'm surprised that like my Twitch channel isn't banned yet like I just, when you like hit that section above, you just know you've jumped too high And it just annoys me every time I see it Cause it's like a millisecond you're up there as well, it's like, for fuck's sake. I gotta wait for myself to come back down, like. I think it needs to sound like the song. I think, yeah, it's more... It, it can be still claimed if it's vocals, but like... If I literally pitch perfect myself to the actual, like, vocalist, or just mimic their voice outright, I probably would get claimed. It's like if Markiplier sang that one song that sounded like him, where it's going like, Aria Maria, Hino Maria. If he sung that song on stream, he would get claimed. Because it seriously just sounds so much like him, like. A <laughs> creeper. I'm Chats. The only other special emotes I have is probably like the Tracer one from um, Overwatch League. But that was when I actually used to care about Overwatch. Literally just uninstalled the uh, launcher today because I was like, eh, I don't need that taking up space on my device. Even though it doesn't take up anything, but like, I don't have any other game from Blizzard uh, or Activision downloaded, so I was like, nah, get rid of it. Like, you make me want to play this. Ooh. If you were to play this, you'd be in a in a big world of hurt. It took me 23 hours to complete the um, first map. This is the second map, and it's I'm 27 hours in, and the third map is even harder than this again. So, yeah, if if you have days to spare, then go ahead. And it's not even that expensive as well. Jump King is like probably 20 quid or something like that. Like, and if you get it from keys, like it's probably cheaper again. Like. I mean, couldn't be as bad as getting over it. I mean, to be fair... Yeah, no, I completed Jump King's first map before I completed getting over it, but then I completed getting over it after completing Jump King's first map. So, in terms of difficulty, I think, yeah, I think really uh, realistically, um, getting over it is actually easier than Jump King. Just in my own regards, anyway. Because I completed Jump King first and then get, uh, getting over it. Watch, I'll finish it in a day. You probably will, honestly, if you dedicate enough to it. Because, like, I do these streams kind of just on and off. And if I'm, um... If I gave it a whole day, I still probably wouldn't be able to do it. Because I'd just be slabbing my keyboard and breaking my keyboard, like... Uh, duo stream. That's another one for the bucket list of uh, duo streams ideas that we still need to get to. Like, I finished that puzzle game in hell. I th no, I think you did it, and I also did it then later on myself as well, so. It was a uh, Helltaker. Or not Hell. Was that? Wait, no, I think it is Helltaker. Oh no, I'm thinking of. No, that's Hell Singer. Yeah, no, Helltaker. I'm pretty sure. But yeah. I think. Yeah, no, we definitely did complete it anyway. Yeah, but I did it in one go. Oh, you mean, I'm more of a pog gamer. You are, honestly, because one, you're younger than me, and two, you probably play more games than I do now. And it's funny to say that, because all my Twitch streams literally revolve around me playing games, like... There's barely streams where I'm actually reacting to something, unless it's like a live stream uh, event, 
a trailer to something or a um, analog horror series, which I actually did edit a video for the back rooms recently, so that should be coming at some point. I mean, on my Xbox, I still have like 800 ready to install. Fair enough, yeah. And like my Twitch, it's I think my Twitch is only a hundred and something games, and then my Epic's like roughly around there as well. Like so, that's like what two hundred odd games. And even on my Xbox, I didn't really have many games at the time because I didn't have much money to be spending on games. So that was like probably roughly fifty games. And if you count some of them games being the same game, so like Destiny, it's not really much of a like minus. And then mobile games. Yeah, sorry, I'm going too much into it. I'm just like, I'm rambling on and on and on, but yeah. Ten years of collecting, yeah. And then it had me basically being unfaithful and... Fa well, not really unfaithful. I still technically did use Xbox Game Pass on PC, so... Actually, no, I did play Spider-Man and God of War, and I cream over them every time, so like... Yeah, maybe I am not a fanboy anymore. I mean, I had Ori 4 on seven different consoles and that. Fair enough, yeah. And now the section that decides if I actually get farther. And now the section... It could be worse. I could go back down to the ice and slip back down to the snow. That's the worst I've done, even in just this stream alone, like... I just know it's too little as well. But I know what I need to do. It's just like... Again, it's that, like, fucking doubt I keep talking about in the stream. And it's, um... Whatchamacallit? It's also the, um, impatience. That's it. That's what happens to me in a lot of games. I just start getting impatient when I die. Or not die, but for in this case, when I fall so much. Actually, that probably... Okay, I'm going to do something stupid here in a minute, just to see if it works. Because if it does work, it'll help me in the future. There's no harm to experiment now, right? Nah, yeah, see, that doesn't work! Yep, there you go. We slide. We slide, my gamer. Got that enchanted shit. Lapis lazuli, my gamer. Little bitches only stare at me. For stare at me? No matter what, what? Original PS, Nintendo Wii, Xbox 360, Xbox One, PC, Xbox Series S, twice with remake and original, and I played it okay, the Switch. Oh shit. <laughs> there I go. There he goes. I need to update the soundboard again. Oh, I love that. Okay, I forgot. I did update the soundboard. I think I literally scouted that one out as well. I was like, I have to find that one. I love the metal pipe. Top 10 anime characters you'd probably bang right in this second, like, to be honest. The PVC pipe comes close, but, like, metal pipe is just where it's at. Like, it's the original, you know? It's like... It's like the, um, fucking, uh, Naruto to the Boruto. It's nostalgic, yeah. Oh, I remember reading ages ago. I think Boruto, like, they're actually taking a break right now. I don't know if they've gone back to making Boruto, but I think they are saying they're going to take a break whilst it's on a good arc right now to, um, like, basically think about what they're doing with the story next and all that. Yeah, pure meme fuel, yeah. It's like the Vine Boom sound effect and all that, and the, um, the bamboo hit sound that, like, anime clips and VTubers use, like. All iconic. And I even used those exact ones in a video recently. Not the metal pipe, obviously, but... Even though I should have, like, an actual sound effect for the metal pipe downloaded onto my system. Just so I could use it in a video. I'll do it randomly one day. I'll just be making a video. I'm like, eh. Let's just drop, like, the fucking metal pipe sound effect in the middle of this video for no reason, like... And make people think they have, like, the hour-long video of the metal pipe falling meme being played in the background. You should find the Left 4 Dead sound where, when a special infected is close. Oh, I'm trying to remember the sound of that. It probably is somewhere on Twitch anyway, because a lot of people have uploaded stuff already for the soundboards to work, so. And I can upload my own things anyway if I wanted to. That's why, like, one of the options is the, um, Cherry Arbor story thing. 
I should improve on that. I kind of just took it from a recent video at the time and I was like, yeah, we'll just have that as a sound effect. Oh! There we go. Yeah. Even though, like, I just... what well, it's probably been... Three different videos recently made relating to Sherry Albersori. I'm still not done yet. I still got to, like, make a... Well, actually, to be fair, it's going to be a while before I make another one because, like, I'm waiting on something else to be made. And it's going to be banging if it's done right. And it might take some time because I have to... Oh, you yeah, know, shit, I was meant to... Fuck, I was meant to get back to another person about something that relates to the thing I'm talking about. Anyway. Um, fine, special. For a meme, you should change the uh, uwu to the man throwing... <laughs> I love that one. No, yeah, I, th I know the exact sound effect you're on about. I fucking love that one. I think, yeah, no, it's like they're all saying ooh woo, and then the last one's like, ooh uh, woo. Just pure, just vomiting up his guts, like. Oh my god. I'm talking so much, my throat is like tightening up. Drying up, drying up, drying up. Oh yeah, the car screech, yeah. I've seen so many different versions of that meme back in the day. I say back in the day, but it was probably just 2018, like... Oh, no, here we go. I hate when the game does that. Like, when you're flat, you can't do anything. You're stuck, like, in that, like, mode until the wind stops pushing you. By the way, if you do play this game, this is going to be your best friend. The wind, alright? The wind's a very good ally of yours because it makes you take your fucking time and makes you want to punch a hole through the monitor, like... Um, the sus boom that has the rock with his eyebrow. Oh yeah, yeah, that one, yeah. Just basically bass boosted. Bass boosted, uh, vine thud sound. I think, yeah, no, the world did start falling apart once vine was, to, like, shut down. Such a shame. Oh, for no! Yes. Change them all for a meme stream. <laughs> That's like a new follower goal event. It's just like meme stream. Oh, we could, we could change the fucking banner thought. Like, you know, the thing that's going to cross the top of my hair. I can change that to fucking Comic Sans. <laughs> oh, no, that would be fucking beautiful. Like. And then on my chest, I could write something like um, maybe an impact font or something instead, like, which is the meme text. Like, yeah. Because the next follower goal event is probably going to be like the 4th of July, even though like I don't really celebrate it, but it'd be cool just to see the theming I'd probably come up with for that, like. There's probably some outfit I could throw together that would uh, be like the Star Spangle. And then every time I start to stream I can go, good morning USA, I've got a feeling that it's going to be a wonderful day. The rock's face with the eyebrow up, but it's Sherry. Yeah, no, I think... I did edit thing over. I wish I could, like, edit the fucking image better than I can. But, uh, well, to be fair, actually, I can work with Liquify a little bit and change the facial structure a tad bit. There we go. Oh, up. Oh. Um. Yeah. I've been so tempted to just get, like, more art pieces, like, of the cast of Sherry Albers currently, but... I'm holding back to actually, like, use the money to work on other stuff for Sherry Arbor's story. Because once this next thing is done, I don't really think there's much more excuses for me to, like, hold off on making sure the first preview of uh, Sherry Arbor's story volume 1 gets released and gets released somewhere. I do know there's a website called, like, Web Novel. I could try and upload it there, but I'd also like to remember the other places I could upload free previews to. I definitely have to do a little bit of asking around. Oh my god. I love that meme I uploaded though. It's like, when you're still working on the light novel series, you say you're still working on I want this fucking song to become a meme so badly. Like, it's just it's such a good song. Like, Oh, that's a delightful pizza. At least cut it up, like... It, it's an okay pizza topping, but like, it shouldn't be like that. 
It's prickly because it doesn't want you to eat it, like. Hey, no, you said it. It's in cotton for well, not in 4K, but in 720p. <laughs> Wrapped up. Oh god. Okay, now you're losing me. You're actually completely losing me. The fucking spikes, the grass. Well, not the grass, but the green part of it, like the leaves. Yes, I forgot the word for like leaves there for a minute. Unless it's called something else because it's a pineapple. So I'll be honest, people do kind of dunk on Hawaiian, but it's actually not that bad. But for Sherry Opera, God, that's even more cursed. Try a fucking strawberry top pizza, but like, it's not even like a dessert themed pizza. It's literally just strawberries on top of tomato, like pizza tacos with big pineapple, pineapple on burger goaded. I actually would try that, the burger one, the uh, pineapple uh, burger. little and we stop underberg is such a good location in this game honestly at least like in the prior map it wasn't that bad like it was windy but like it wasn't as bad as this one that, like, that's all I'll really say about it I still love my reaction to that, honestly. Just pure, genuine, just... It's just a big weight has been lifted off my shoulder because I completed the game, like... And doing it under 24 hours is kind of pog as well, to be honest. Even though I know the world record is, like, probably 10 minutes or some shit like that. But it's not about looking outwards to see who else is succeeding. It's looking towards in yourself and seeing how much you progressed. And how you've changed. And how you've overcome the hurdle, you know? Go stand near that person if you fall. Which person? I'm assuming it's this person up here you're on about. Because he does say shit, if that's what you're wondering. I'll go to him now, like, just let me, uh, redirect my course. Because I'm kind of on autopilot right now. If my autopilot would actually function correctly. I, don't, I think, it, yeah, you were the one that suggested I watch Buddy Daddies, wasn't it, or something like that? Because I did start watching it. I'm not going to lie, I don't like the girl at all in that. But I'm still watching it anyway. Yes, yes, I can sense it. I'm nearing the breakthrough. Any moment now. Haha. <laughs> no, wait, that's not it. Any time now, though. Oh, okay. <laughs> Just, that's what the sound effect was for. Just had to leave him a little gift, like. Oh, this is going to be a bad draw. Never mind, actually, it's not that bad. Now too early? Yep, too early. This is all I can do when I wait down here is just spam keys until I get up. Like, that's how, like, impatient I am. It's either I make a mistake and be impatient, or I just fucking smash, like, the keys. Say that every time you fall far and it'll uh, never be a bad drop. I can't remember what I said about farting on people, leaving them a gift. That's as much as I remember what I just said. Like, I swear the conversations I have on stream are actually just... They go in one ear and they go out... The, well, they stay in my, like, head for, like, a millisecond and they leave, like, the moment they're not being used anymore, like... No, say this will be a bad fall. Ah, oh, yeah, actually, no, yeah, it's, like, reverse psychology. It has worked a few times. But I've used it so much that it just gets boring to use all the time. Yeah, no, this one's going to be a good one. Because I can guarantee the jump for that. It's just with the wind, you actually really do have to wait for the conditions to be right to jump. Whereas for this, like, you can kind of just do it whenever. As long as you position yourself right. 
And that's the joy of Jump King as well. Like, there's not even much controls to learn in this. There's just mechanics that, like, happen in different levels. That you kind of just have to get the grips with when you reach them. I think this one's, like, main... Th oh, God. This one's main, I guess, mechanic is just... Well, not even teaching you of slopes, it's letting you suffer with slopes. Because if you'd notice half the time, I fucking fall out of this place because of the slopes. It's rarely ever that I just drop down through my own will, like... Like, even there, like, it's showing you, like, Hey, look, I'm a slope, have fun. Just give me a minute. Sometimes I do just get so invested that I'm just not even looking, like... Eh... Uh, Gotch darn, this lad kept him falling. Ice part is best. The ice part makes me want to tear out my eyes, honestly. Well, the... I can actually know the original is not as bad as the current one, honestly. I think everything in this is just like... It's the same as before, but it's just like... Harder. But then again, there are some new, like, mechanics and new ways the mechanics are used as well. Like, I will say, the snow and wind were one, like, map mechanic, basically. We're together in the same map. Whereas in this one, they're two separate things. And the ice as well, actually, in snow. They were, like... Actually, to be fair, no, in the ice sec... No. Yeah, no, in the ice section, in the snow and... Yeah, no, snow and ice in this one are separate as well. <sighs> I'd rather bash my head against that than fall. This is going to be a bad fall, bro. No cap, for real, for real, this is going to be a bad fall. Absolutely terrible. Oh, no, it's a bad fall. Now, I know I'm going to be alright when I drop down there. I'm just not going to be alright tomorrow morning when I've smashed my keyboard and I have to buy a new one. I don't even know why I jumped on the spot there. It just hurts more when I just do shit like that. I make progress, but then it's just incremental. That's an okay sp Okay, it's not an okay spot if I can't fucking jump up it. Thank you. Daddy, daddy, do. Oshi Unusa. Kila, kila. I've said that wrong, it's meant to be. No, I can't remember now. You know, that describes my singing just perfectly. It's mad to think those are like actual like sounds of people farting when you think about that. Because there's probably someone that did suffer that fate, like to just get that sound. Unless that was recreated, then that's even more impressive. Because I know it sounds like that can be recreated through other means, but... It's probably funnier to think that they're real. Because as someone that did music in college, seeing how, like, certain sounds are made in films and stuff was eye-opening, like... Because I knew, like, it was made different ways. Because obviously, like, when bone cracks in a fucking film, you're not going to just crack someone's, uh, actual bone. You're going to do different shit, like... And sure, you think, oh, maybe just crack, like, a chicken bone or something. But it's like, oh, no, sometimes it's like they take different bits and bobs just to make one bone cracking sound. And to make it, like, stand out more as well. But anyway, that's a rare occasion I start talking about college again. All right, we know it's gamer time. I'm going to take this off. And we're going to put this one on. It's not even that warm, but I know it's going to heat up soon. I just feel it in me bones, laddie. I feel it in me bones. Oh. And by the way, the vest I'm wearing right now, the thing we did during that one weekend, which I won't mention on stream, um, I left my, like, uh, vest behind. <laughs> like, when we um, went home, I realized that I, like, left it behind. I was like, oh, shit. Well, I guess I'll just buy a new one. It's <laughs> just like... Not even a skin off my nose, just like, ah, oh, cool, it was old anyway.
Nah, I'm too much. Yeah. Imagine the platforms, Bruh. but they were actually bigger. Like, better and bigger. Bruh. My, my, cute. I don't even think I even said that sentence when I was in the maid dress, which is kind of bizarre to me. I definitely said the, um, Okai Nasai Goshimi sama. And I'm probably gonna have to learn it again soon because I fucking said it as the <laughs> next milestone goal. Like, Except I'm not gonna be wearing a black maid dress, I'm gonna be wearing a blue or pink one. I'm probably gonna have to spin a wheel for that, and then I'm fucking. I'm benching that goal for a while. Gotta let other goals shine and take deep breaths, you know? Fancy. Ye. Yeah. I might as well just learn a different language at this point. I, I, I should just give up on English and just speak another language better, like. So we have Irish, we have Japanese, we have Chinese, uh, we have French, because I did a bit of French in school. And then there's other languages in the world that I could also study. I think Irish, though, would be a nice flex. German would be, like, fucking gas just because, like, you could sound like you're saying the most egregious shit ever just by shouting it. But really, you're just saying the fucking word for ambulance, like. And then Polish. Latin. I know Irish is a dead language, but you don't need to bring another dead language into this, like. I know I'm wasting my time learning Irish, but, like, at least, like, there's at least two people in the whole continent, or not continent, the whole country that still speak it, like. Actually, no, to be fair, Latin's even studied in fucking secondary school. Which is weird when you think about it. Yeah, to be- no, yeah, no, I take that back, because honestly, like, Latin is an actual subject in fucking school. Like, in secondary school. I seen it on the leaving, sir, like, and I was like, what? Why? Who the fuck is learning Latin, like? Why are you learning Latin? Like, is there somewhere in the world that still speaks it? There must be, right? Because why else would you learn it? To be fair, actually, there was- I don't know if, like, um, <laughs> satanic beings. I don't know if you've seen this as well on your own, Leaving Surf, but like fucking, there was somebody actually like learning Japanese, and I seen that as a subject on the fucking Leaving Surf. I was like, damn, nobody told me that was on. I would have given it a crack, you know, given it a shot, even if it was like an extra subject. Seen before, yeah. Because yeah, no, it was on the official thing. That's why it was there. Didn't necessarily mean I think like that somebody would in our own school would have learned it, but that's just gas to think about. What? That's bizarre. That was JoJo's bizarre adventure right there. That's like the synopsis for part 1, 2, and 3, just right there, like. And now that's the synopsis for part 4. Part 5 synopsis coming soon. Actually, no, maybe part 6 is synopsis, like. <clears throat> no, Stip. No, JoJo. Why no, JoJo? I'm surprised I don't even have a JoJo, um, sound effect. To be honest, though, like, unfortunately, Part 6 wasn't really, um, well-received, I don't think, just because it was so under wraps, like. <laughs> JoJo bad. JoJo good. I can't wait, though, for the next part, because the next part is literally just a reboot, basically, of the franchise, like. And then I think it leads on to the, um... I think it's... Well, they're saying it's going to be the end of JoJo after part 10 or something like that, but I don't think it will. I think it's genuinely going to be just like, um... The, like, the author themselves are probably just going to keep going. Only Joe I like is Joe, my friend, but I don't know where he went. <laughs> it's just like, who is this guy that's just talk about JoJo? Somebody must have really annoyed you about JoJo. I wonder who that was. 
To be fair, actually, do, did I talk about it? I'm joking at the same time. Here I can just close my eyes and do a little bit of jumping. I say that as I open my eyes, but just, you know, just in case. Happy to, certain, you know? No! If we move away from JoJo and talk about Destiny 2, I don't think I've even mentioned this yet. But I am planning not to buy Destiny's last DLC. Or, well, Destiny 2's supposedly last DLC for the saga. I might just play it on Xbox instead. Oh god, oh god. Okay, we're good. Um, the reason I want to is like to see if I can actually stop playing Destiny, even if it's just for a day or two. And to see how I go. But to be fair, I'm trying to stop myself from playing probably what's probably going to be a good DLC as well. Brother in arms, can you just not fucking drop that heart, please? No, it's just a guy called Nathan who would talk about Jojo like it was a religion. I don't like religion and he kept nagging me to watch it. No, yeah, that's fair. Because I do understand that, like, you know, as a Jojo fan, I do agree that we do kind of suck a lot of cock. But, like, sometimes it does get a bit overwhelming. Like, even just for any franchise, when somebody just over talks about it too much, like, and treat it like a religion, as you say. I like the memes, not the show. Yeah, to be fair, I don't even doubt you for not liking the show, because, like, after being told so much about, oh, it's really good, bro, you should watch it, it's like... Well, I mean, like, you're probably gonna have a, like, worse, like, um, view of the show because somebody's, like, goaded you into thinking it's the best shit ever, like. And the only thing I will argue with is that, like, technically... Yeah, technically each part is its own thing. But at the same time, it's just like, if you don't like one of them, then, like, even if you do watch another part, you're probably still not gonna like it anyway, like. I guess it just depends as well, because part one and two are kind of like in their own thing, and the rest of the parts are then like basically the rest of the series you can start watching from. But yeah, again, I won't go too much on about that. It's just like, yeah. Yes, 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 yes. I will reference memes now. And I will drink water whilst the wind takes its time. Ah. Another annoying part about the wind is that it pushes you into positions you don't want to be in. Like, I don't want to be inside with the statue. Or, well, not even statue with the people. I want to be outside in the wind. Breathing in all this sulfur-looking air, like. Oh, also, I have news about my dog since the last day we talked. I was telling you that they were going to the vets. Oh, yeah, no, if you want to talk about it it's, uh, on stream, it's up to you. But if you want to DM me, it's all good. Cause I am kind of curious on how they're doing. I'll even stop the stream. I have to just pause it for a minute because I probably should take a break soon anyway. Like from constantly playing this and slamming my head against the wall. Oh, for fuck's sake! I heard it. I heard the little dink, and I was like, "Nope, I'm gonna fall." See, I can let this push. Okay, not entirely. When I try and demonstrate something, and it's like, no, I'm not gonna follow you. I'm not gonna follow you on that one, Chief. It's kind of you on your own. Oh, jeez. Aw. That's sad to hear, honestly. Especially with fucking, like, Molly having cancer. Because it's like, as you said, like, she's too old to have surgery. So, like, there's literally not much else you can do in that scenario. And you're saying, um, what you call it? Gypsy has, like, um, arthritis, like. Yeah, that's just shit all around, honestly. Like, obviously, the only real thing I can say is just, like, you know, basically just treasure your time. Because, like, 
Yeah. <laughs> Sorry, it's just like, I literally just have no words, like. Uh, Molly is 14. We're surprised she's uh, lived as long as she has, but I say she'll probably pass near the end of the year or soon after. Yeah. It, it is sad shit. That's why I know before... Um, <clears throat> I was talking to a college mate once, and we were talking about the um, whole, like, oh, if you had a pet, would you? And it's like, oh, no, I wouldn't. And, like, their literal excuse was basically just, oh, well, I don't really want to get really attached to them. And then, you know, when they grow up, die. Like, I just couldn't go through that. Like, you know, it's just, yeah. And me, like, my parents just never really wanted a pet in the house in the first place. So that's literally the only reason we have never had a pet, so... Yeah. I hope they, ha like, take it easy, but have fun, you know, with, well, with Molly anyway, like, with, as you may predict her last, like, uh, <clears throat> year or two, you know? I always do try to tell myself or, well, try to convince myself at certain stages of, like, the month to be like, ah, oh, yeah, try not to take things for granted, because, like, once they're gone, like, they're gone, like. When it comes to people and pets and all that sort of stuff. And even just, like, I've mentioned the moving before on stream, so I can mention it here, but it's like, I'm trying to not also take for granted, like, um, going outside on mocks and stuff, and just going out in general when, like, it's easier to um, go out now than it will be later on. And I'm just not going to mention location stuff, obviously, so, yeah. Yeah. You yeah, know, I'll definitely, like, obviously next time I'm down to yours, I'll definitely see them myself anyway. I'm still doing that thing where it's like when I jump in I do like a little bit of a backstroke to try and like save myself from falling but like I'm not slipping on ice I'm not being pushed by the wind like you know they both seem to be doing good that's at least good to hear oh shit oh my god okay oh. I just hope the medication does help as much as it can do you know but then again, they wouldn't really give it to you if, like, it wasn't going to help. But then again, usually for medicines and stuff, isn't there, like, you know, you give someone weak stuff first, and then you just keep going from there until it gets stronger, and then it actually helps them out or something like that. I wouldn't know too much, because the length of medicine for me is literally just, like, I take, like, stuff that you can just get on the shelf and go from there. And then when it came to, like, my ear, though, that was probably the first time I had to actually go from... Oh, this shit ain't working? Okay, we have to bump it up. But, like, we didn't even need to bump it up because of fucking... Like, the doctor was, like... Just, they didn't know what they were doing. Until the nurse came in and actually knew what she was doing and actually said, Oh, yeah, no, they actually just need this, you know? Oh, yeah, for people, yeah. Because dogs are probably different, aren't they? Sorry, I didn't factor that in. Oh, my God. Okay, I need to be careful here. Oh, you know that fucking, um, you know that thing you kept saying about Transformers being in Fortnite? They actually do finally have Transformers in Fortnite. Because I know, like, you were memeing about it ages ago, yeah. You know? Yeah. But then again, you probably saw leaks, right, or something like that, and that's why you know. Or is it just, like, you knew because you seen the promotional uh, piece for it recently? Uh, I wasn't memeing. Oh, yeah. So you, you just knew it, like. Yeah. Yeah. For me and stuff, when it comes to leakage stuff, uh, for other games, I don't really care about it. But then it, when it comes to Destiny stuff, it's like... It's like, of all the leaked content I could see on YouTube, it's always fucking Destiny for me. 
And I'm always pissed off about it as well. Because I it's the same thing they keep fucking leaking to me. I know that something's gonna happen in Destiny 2 now, like a cutscene. It's obviously I think like every season there is at least one major cutscene that happens that turns the story on its head. But like the fact that they fucking name it is just so annoying. Cause at first I think I thought it was like a fan made thing and I realized, oh wait shit, this says leak in it. Like that's another reason I don't really peruse Twitter too much or any other forums for that matter. I'm just scared I'll come across leaks like for Destiny. But then again, when I come back to talking now about the final shape and not playing it, that's different. I'm probably gonna like, again, play that on Xbox or something when it comes out. Um, or I'm just gonna watch somebody play or talk about it. Even though I, th like, deep down inside of myself, I know the next DLC is probably gonna be a banger. Because Bungie deliver when it's right. But like at the same time, I can't bring myself to spend another hundred quid without at least seeing the contents first. And then seeing the community's reception to it first. I want to at least do that much for this next Destiny DLC. Because at least then if it is a stinker, then I'm like, oh grand, I just saved myself like under a hundred quid. Because like. right now the only reason I'm playing Destiny is because like... I kind of have to to make use of the 100 euro I spent on it, like, or well, under 100 euro. So that's why, like, every so often you see me on Destiny, but I'm fishing, because it quite literally is helping me progress, like, with, um, not even just story stuff, just, like, I do that and then I'll do an event and it levels me up slightly, so I'm just slowly leveling up my battle pass, basically. And then I'll do, like, the story and other characters now to try and get them to, like, rank a or try to get the battle pass to rank 100. Because once it's rank 100 and I've played the story on one character, I'm solid for a season, honestly. I'm not even going to play, like, the fucking seasonal events anymore. I'm going to hop off. Send us a text when you finish up. I will try to if I do remember. Take care, man. I need to take another swig of water. Oh. Uh, what do I have left to eat? I actually don't even... Yeah, no, I, honestly, I have been kind of munching through quite a bit in the house. I try not to double, like, dip on eating certain things. So, like, I won't eat crisps twice. I won't eat, like, a sandwich twice, depending on the day. I won't, like, for... Currently, I have beans, like, in pots. I won't eat that, those twice, even though I wouldn't even mind that. Um... For the, like, toast bread thing, though, that would actually kind of count for the beans. I, I'd give myself an excuse to use at least a slice of bread just to dip in to soak up the, like, sauce and eat it. Uh, when it comes to, like, a, um, a little snack bar, I'll eat one of those. Breakfast bar, I'll eat one of those. Ice cream, I'll only eat one of those. Salami, it's like, I'll basically eat the whole pack and just leave two over in case I want it for a sandwich later. And... What else? I think that's it, actually, for what I eat. Because even then, when it comes to, like, uh, drinking, like, um, like a fizzy drink for dinner, or even sparkling water, I'll only, like, drink a certain amount for dinner. And if I'm going to have, like, a drink, like, um, I currently have Kraken, which, actually, oh, I should have mentioned that to Brando when he was here. Because he was the one that suggested I'd probably try it at some point in time. But, um... When I, like, I have Kraken currently, because it's my birthday, I thought, oh, I'll buy myself a nice one. Just to see what's, like, something different. I'll have, like, a fizzy drink or, um, sparkling... Actually, no, I haven't even tried sparkling water with it yet, but I probably will. And this is flavoured sparkling water, by the way. It's not fucking just sparkling water, because sparkling water by itself is just mad. But, like, flavoured sparkling water just hits different. I don't know what it is about it. I think it's just the flavouring that just makes it hit different, like... But it's like, it's literally the same thing, just, oh look, we have a little bit of a flavour in, like. Which actually reminds me. Next big fall, I'm gonna get myself a drink. I deserve it after the amount of abuse I'm putting myself through right now. And Twitch, that's abuse in the sense of me manipulating myself into still playing this game. And that wasn't a major fall, we don't count that. Oh, okay. If I fell through the crack just there, I probably would have counted that, to be honest. And plus, my voice is kind of running out right now, so I need to, like, maybe stop and get a drink soon. And refill on my water as well. 
Oh, such a nice drink yesterday because I had a good bit of ice in it. And usually I wouldn't even have a lot of ice, but like this ice was enough to sustain itself. So it's just pretty nice, like. I look like I'm a bit red. How am I red? I've literally only been outside today for like 10 minutes, like. I literally have not touched grass today. Like, how come? How, why, why I burn? I'm not even near my window. My window's like on the opposite side of my room. Which to be fair, isn't that far. It's only like two meters away from me, but still. Okay, two meters is a bit of an exaggeration. It's like three and a half meters. It's basically a New York apartment that's worth 4,000 euro. Or dollars, should I say. Or dolans. <laughs> Dollar Roonies. God, I kind of want to throw. <laughs> I just, I just, I want to throw now just so I could fall far and actually get myself a drink. I gotta do it, man. I gotta do it. I gotta get myself that drink. I was actually thinking about that at some point. Even if it's not with friends, just going on my own, going to the pub and just seeing what it's like on my own, like... Oh, where, where are you going? Throwing! What are you throwing? Oh yeah, that was a major fall, that counts. Um, basically just going to a pub by myself and just like, seeing what happens, you know? Anyway, BRB. Right, we have returned to the land of the living. Am I, is my model still... I think we are. I'm turning to the side, I see my eyes turning. Right. I have to take the time to actually take more sips of that. As time goes on, because my room is so warm. Like I was just, I'll go new, okay, we're good. Because I just like re-entered my room and I was like, damn bitch, you live like this? Holy shit. To be fair, it's not, it is kind of my fault that my room is kind of a hot box. But to be fair, like, it was fucking shady weather outside. Like, I had to close my window, like. I couldn't have kept it open, like. You sure know how it is now? Ah, oh, fuck, that's not gonna work. It is gonna work. I don't know why I doubted myself. I was gonna say, like, okay, now I don't take another sip of the drink until I actually reach back to where I want to, but... <sighs> the drink will actually not only just be flat, the ice in it will melt. And, um, it'll be fucking, like, boiling. By the time I ever actually reach back up here, like. I just guarantee you that. You know, I'm actually glad I started streaming today. Good choice for game, even if I am just slamming my head against the wall. Um, oh, there's something else I was going to talk about and I can't remember now. It's like I have that moment when I think about something to talk about during the stream when I'm off the stream. But then when I'm back on the stream, I can't think of it. It's like when you think of something before you sleep, but then like the next day you're just like, bruh, why can't I remember it? It's such a good thing I was going to do as well, like. Thank you. Okay, there we go. Take a sip. I can't do that loud, like, click sound that your man does, Michael Rosen. Into the mouth. Nice. You... What are you doing? Hello, brain. Are you aligned in there? Oh, for fuck's sake. But yeah, no. I kind of wish I was drinking this more of, like, Coke, but... Unfortunately, I still want to finish my white lemonade drink, so I'm going to drink that first, whiff it, and then go from there. And plus, I, I, I'm starting to see more of the value for ice at home, especially when it's this warm. It does keep the drink cooler for longer, like. And plus, like, I keep it in the, like, um, cupboard anyway, the, like, bottle, so, like, it's warm. But to be fair, it doesn't make up most of the drink. Most of the drink is literally just the white lemonade itself, like. Oh, excuse me. That's the drink talking now. 
kicking up a storm in my stomach with the steak that's down there. I don't know why I doubted myself there for a minute. I'm just a gamer, like, through and through, I'm just a gamer. Ah. Oh. That was actually perfection. It was perfect, down to last minute detail. I was going to say last atom, but it's actually ma last minute detail, I think the meme is. I still need to watch shows like that. I still haven't gotten around to them. Like I still haven't even finished Breaking Bad, so like I need to start with that saga first. Like Finish Breaking Bad, finish the film, and then watch Better Call Saul. And if there's a film for that, I need to watch that as well. To be fair though, there's a lot of shows I haven't finished. And not even because I've just like not liked them anymore and I've left them. It's just I just haven't even gotten back around to like watching them like. Like fucking Rick and Morty like is a show I haven't gone back to like in a while. And I probably should. Cause it's just been a while. I was gonna go the other way, that's why I stopped there for a minute. Too much. Oh my god. Since it is Pride Month, I have a special follower goal coming up. For this month and this month alone, if we hit a thousand followers... <laughs> no, <I can't> even. <laughs> the cock will be sucked. This is what it means to truly support the LGBT plus Q community. I think it's that. I, I, I did get that right, didn't I? I, I don't think I got that wrong. To be fair though, I still find it funny that Opera just- They literally just have two men kissing as their profile thing. And like, everyone that's like, affiliate with them or have like a sponsorship with them also has that icon beside their name. I'd love to have that badge, honestly. And actually, that reminds me of the other meme that I think it was La Pony. No, not La Pony, that's a fucking Pokemon. The um, there's like a bunny VTuber. And it's like that old like TikTok meme where it's like, cooking videos and they show just men kissing in the middle and she just goes like this person's looking at men kissing they're looking at men kissing oh it's just gas man see in a sense i do kind of miss tiktok like watching it a lot but at the same time i don't and i have noticed that even just recently like when i watch the one odd short i almost instinctively start scrolling again but i'm like nope joe you said you'd stop this no more scroll but i am burning through a lot of long form content. It's like I need a replacement soon. I need a lot more subscriptions on YouTube. I need to subscribe to probably Netflix again or something to keep up my um, want for watching long form content. Unfortunately for like, I don't know why, like even just for any show, like if it's YouTube, like in YouTube itself, I don't mind listening to it in the background. But when it comes to like a show that's like on a different platform, like I have, well actually Twitch I don't mind watching the background as well. But like, when it comes to Netflix and stuff like that, I can't watch them in the background. I have to be like, focused on it like. Maybe that just speaks volumes for the shows I choose to watch. And I can't even say I have that much shit taste, like I'm literally just watching what like a lot of other people watch as well. You can just say I have normie taste, in that kind of sense I guess. And, yeah, I hate that fucking jump so much! Man, what a boss. What a baby gaming rager. Raging baby gamer, there we go. I don't know even know why I said that the opposite way around, like... You can tell my brain's not loading anything anymore. It's stuck on this autopilot scenario. Where I go up, I fail, drop back down here, do the same, repeat. There's no such thing as not failing. And not failing heavily is like a thing we've already done during the stream. So I probably have one more big fail coming up before I slam my keyboard. 
I think the more I'm saying it, the more I'm willing it into existence, but I'd like to see life try. And plus, it gets me out of the house. I actually have an excuse to go out tomorrow. Of course, other than, like, staying back and actually, you know, celebrating Father's Day and stuff. Oh, for fuck's sake! It's the same one! Just in case you've come across the stream randomly and you're watching in the background, d don't bother. J just go watch Lazy Panda instead. I bet she's streaming. If she's not streaming, then I don't know who else you can watch. Watch some other Jump King streamer. They're probably actually making progress and giving better commentary. Like, as for me, I'm literally just slamming my head against a wall. I have really stuck to that phrase. I need to stop saying that. When I notice I've been overusing a phrase, I think I need to like actually like stop myself from overusing it so much. But if it's a meme and it's funny, I'll keep doing it. Well, funny to me, even if it becomes cringe, like... Troll face? Me gusta? Literally picks the oldest fucking examples of memes, like... But hey, you know what? It made me laugh. That's what's important, like... If you're gonna entertain, it's first important to make yourself laugh before you make others laugh. I guess, in a sense. You don't, have, you don't always have to sacrifice your happiness for other people's happiness. Sometimes you can make yourself happy and then just make others happy along the way. That actually sounds like an anime plot and a half. Or something an anime character would say. Ah! Pain. 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 I'll show this world pain. You motherfucker. The ice cubes melted, by the way, which is a big sad moment. I can still taste the uh, sharper taste of the uh, rum. Okay, see, the only reason I panicked there and I went the other side more because I knew I was going to fall off because I was being dumb. Unfortunately, being dumb is like actually just, it's like, it's actually a like skill that you need to acquire over time as I'm demonstrating in this gameplay too much <sighs> yeah no I, I, I'm sorry but like I'm never like I'll bring back the cat ears no bother but like the fucking rabbit ears I just don't like I don't like the way they look I probably should look at them again because you could probably customize them to be a bit better but like last time I wore them it's just annoying because I have to reposition the model so that the ears are actually in the shot and they're not cutting off which is just so annoying oh for fuck's sake I'm gonna slip on the ice and it's gonna happen again I didn't even try to stop myself I was I was just doing myself a favor in advance like Ah, uh, if you hear a window shatter, don't don't worry about it. Oh, I'm not throwing this. My mom gave me this. I'm not I'm not gonna throw something my mom gave me. There we go. At least if I break something here, most of it is bought by me. Except this. This is actually a gift from someone else. So actually, I'll keep that. Actually, let me smell this again. Oh, it's so nice. I should use it more. I just don't have a reason to use it, because I'm not really going on any dates or anything like that. I'd probably use it if I was meeting up with someone that I liked. Right, fidget spinner break time. Right, until I finish my- well, I say I, until I finish my drink, but I'm almost finished, like. Oh, wait, no, I think the ice is still in there. It's, like, really small, but it's right there. It's like- it's like an atom in the fucking, like, cup right now. <sighs> yeah, if you do notice as well, I do struggle to pull back my mouse every so often. Like, you might hear me audibly just be like... Like, doing this with the mouse. I don't know if you can hear that. But that's because, again, the mouse is, like, now plugged into the front of the computer, and it's not really... I, I think it did disconnect once, but it reconnected instantly. So, for now, the mouse still lives, and it's not the computer. 
But I really should be taking what my computer's doing uh, as a thing. Actually, yeah. No, recently, I was actually looking at my computer's... Um, uh, whatchamacallit? My computer's... Uh, it's like the uh, motherboard kind of like interface. My fucking... I think it was my CPU or something like that. Or the motherboard. Either or. The, one of them was like 60 odd degrees. So like no wonder it's so fucking hot in this room, man. I really need to turn off this computer and actually put thermal paste under it. I gotta be stop scared, like stop being scared of it and actually do it, and see if the computer cools down a shit ton. Cause it would help me out in terms of temperature control. And um, yeah, and the main reason I was even doing it is cause like I, I didn't even mention this before, but with Google Play uh, or Google in general, they've made Google Play games uh, emulator base beta basically on PC. Um, what we call it? Let me actually just show it real quick. I'm straight. I'll just show the icon. Um, what you call it? Let me high jump king for a minute. Uh, oh yeah, I still need. I forgot. I need, okay, never mind. I can't show. It. But like basically, um, it's a beta kind of thing now, and you can play like over a hundred games emulated from uh, phone to PC. But it's like actually official. It's from Google. Like they're the ones that are actually doing it themselves. And I have it downloaded myself, so if I ever want to download a certain mobile game and give it a shot, I can do it on PC instead of just downloading it onto my phone. Ugh. I might actually consider it, though, but, like, the 100-plus games they have already are mostly dog shit anyway. Like, I'd, run, I'd want something like um, the games that I actually play, like music rhythm games, to be available. Then I'd consider it, like... There's only, like, one music rhythm game there, but, yeah... But it is cool though, like, or not even cool, it's kind of sad actually in a sense. Because like Google have given up so much on like their Stadia idea that they shut down not too long ago that they're trying to expand Google Play onto PC now. And it's such a fucking smart decision as well. If you can get PC players hooked on your fucking mobile games on your store, bruh, that's like, that's a lot of revenue waiting to be collected. I don't know why it hasn't even been done sooner, because I think it's like Bluestacks is like an emulator and upon itself. It's not official, but like it does emulate games onto PC as well. And like, if Google Play does it really well, and they do it officially, and they do like a nice um, emulate, like make a nice emulator for mobile games on the PC, people are just going to switch to the Google Play one, because it's like, you know, you have all your stuff and it's all official and it's all good, like. Now, to be fair, though, with Bluestacks, you could probably still play games that are, like, shut down or something like that, I'd assume. Because an emulator usually does preserve, like, old shit, so. But, like, with that Google Play scenario, though, that's fucking genius. Oh, shit. Well, first time we touched snow. Okay. First time we've touched snow since we started playing today. Mother! Of God. Please get me the fuck back up. Please, I beg. Don't leave me here. Michael. <coughs> Michael. Don't leave me here. Michael. Michael. Oh, for fuck's sake. Oh, this is arguably worse. Oh, this is worse. It's not even arguable anymore. Oh, for fuck's sake. Ah! I, I, do I hop this way? Oh, for fuck's sake. Ah! I want to die. Oh, you mother f lover. You absolutely love mothers, don't you? <laughs> Just do it, Joe! Pussy, you won't do it! You won't do it! You won't drop down! Do it!
Anyway, guys, welcome back to me restarting my uh, Jump King uh, playthrough because we were kind of doing a bit long on time there. So I thought we'd start again from the very start and struggle with the first jump. You know how it is. Sometimes the first jump is always the worst jump. But then once you get started, you just fall back down and you start again, you know? <sighs> the game is actually fucking testing my patience because now I'm basically just restarting the game from the start. Sometimes it just takes great patience to get back to your greatness. Master Uguay, 2018. Actually, I don't even think he was alive during 2018, to be honest. Uh, 20, 2009. I don't know when Kung Fu Panda came out. All I know, it's a banging film. Watch one and two. I can't remember the third one. I probably should watch it again if I haven't already watched it. Blame the drink for this. There's not even much alcohol in my drink, but I still blame it. I want to jump here because I want to get a better st uh, spot on the platform. Get a better spot on the platform. Hold me back, bro. You'd think I'd be doing a speed run with how efficiently I'm doing this section, honestly. <laughs> I just need to do- it's literally just this jump. I'm fucking doubting myself for no reason. I've done it fucking multiple times and for some reason- WHY?! Yeah, yeah, whatever. Stay stuck in your cage forever, rotten teeth. At least with you crows, you were locked up before you could flock the whole fucking upper sections, like. Ah! No. No. I didn't even actually know that. I should keep that in mind if I can. I didn't even know that either, I should keep that in mind. I DID KNOW THAT! I shouldn't have kept that in mind, I should have just blocked it from memory. Too, like, little. Too little. Too little. That's better. As I said before, we're revisiting the old areas. It's gonna be nostalgic before I absolutely ass blast the game. Trust, it's gonna happen. It's not copium. It's just it's just the truth. It's gonna happen. given up on talking at this point like just see look when I fucking talk that happens like that's the reason I give it up. Like, I swear actually I probably would be doing so much better if I just didn't fucking say a word I think me talking so much and rambling distracts me so much from playing the game like fuck my god please just let me up I beg it's happening the keyboard smash! If 
if we reach a certain hour in Jump King, I will smash my keyboard. It's not even a thing where I just get angry and do it, it's going to be a now a follower goal kind of thing. On the fifth hour of his Jump King stream, he decided to snap his keyboard because he didn't complete the game. Or get back to where he wanted at the very least. I think that's more generous to me. Nah, it's too short. That's too sh No, that's still good. Except your jumping's off, your whack, your bro, your shoes, your shoes, your shoes, your shoes, your shoes, your shoes, your, shoes, your fucking head. Man. The head on your shoulders. Too low. Literally, I'm just speaking doubt at this point. I'm not, I'm not even speaking what I'm actually like doing. I'm just speaking doubt. Which is kind of just sad. How we've reached this point. <sighs> oh, why? No. See, like, the thing is as well. There shouldn't really be much else I could be pissed off at at this point. Because it's just like, bro, like, I'm literally at rock bottom here. Like, there's nowhere fucking else to go but up. But no, I'm still getting more pissed off here than I have when I was up at the fucking thing section. I think it's because I've already done this, and it's just pissing me off that I can't get out of this section. I envy anyone who has actual patience and they, tr like, play Jump King. Because if they play it, they will soon learn the reason why they, like, they shouldn't give patience to just everything. Even if it's the right thing to do. Sometimes you have to be impatient. Sometimes you have to lash out. Sometimes you just have to tell everybody how you're feeling. I feel like that song lurks, but I don't even know what song it's from. <laughs> it does definitely sound like some song lurks someone's made before. Okay, too much. So, why are you doing that? Joe, no, here, psychological evaluation time. Why are you doing that? Why are you stupid? Like, what is the reason for this blunder? Why do you, like, bring shame to this family? Can you at least try to act like you're doing the, like, actual level? Like, can you, no, can you actually seriously just act like you're doing the game and not, like, trolling on purpose? No, that's too, that's not gonna work. That's what Doubt said, until I started my comeback arc. So it started down at the very bottom. I had to position myself a bit better here to actually get over to here. But once I passed this section, the rest of the sections weren't actually that bad, even regardless of these blunders I'm making right now at being very bottom. But still, I just persevered. That's all you gotta do, just persevere, and you'll make it back up eventually. Say, so look, you get up here, you get up here, and then you get up here, right? And then you get back up here, you jump over, you jump like this, you jump like that, you jump over here, you jump up like this, you go over like this, then you go over like this, and then you jump over here, so you go over to the edge of this one, then you can get back onto this platform, you get over here, you can jump up to here, jump all the way up to here, where you missed it before, you jump to there, there, and you could, sometimes you can do that, but I realized just there, that was probably the worst mistake of my life, because I kind of want to just die after that. So then you do it all again, right? You just teach yourself again. Okay, I know what to fucking do. It's just a matter of not being stupid and, like, you know, giving myself the stupid commentary to try and talk over, to try and hide how angry I am right now. But at the same time, you've got to do something else other than being angry, so that's the only reason I'm continuing this, like, little line of dialogue. Because if I don't do this little di line of dialogue, this fucking keyboard is going to be smashed into a million pieces. So let's keep it up a bit as the saliva built up in my mouth just there, which is why I had to stop talking. So now I'm going to jump over here, jump up to here. We're going to jump back up to here where the fairy is. And I just realized, aren't these the same fairies that are up in the moss section? That's kind of actually a neat detail. But these ones aren't as annoying as the ones up there. Now this is going to hit off that, so you have to go back down here. Represent yourself here, jump up to here, jump back here. Full send it up here, go over to here. Uh, well, you know, you can fail that if you want. But then, you know, you're just going to relearn that if you go back up to here... 
you can actually relearn this section again. So if you ever do drop back down again, you can actually fucking do it again. So see, you jump up to this platform, you jump over here, you jump up to here, you jump up to the ferry, or the bird thing, whatever it is. It's a light source. Now this time we're going to try this way, because honestly, we have a bit more room to work with. But with this, we can actually jump up to here, jump onto that platform, jump up to this platform, jump onto this, skip the middle one, jump up to this ice one, jump up to here, right? You slide a little bit, you try and position yourself where you might be able to go up, so you get up there, you get up to here, then you get up to here somehow. Now, you see, you take your chances, right? But then you go for it. You don't do the jump there, because if you do the jump, you stop moving to the side. And that's why I kept falling before, and I fell all the way to the bottom. Then at this point, you're meant to jump up to here. Sometimes you'll bounce off that if you're doing it right, but I didn't do it right there, so I'm not going to bounce off that properly. You jump onto this crow cage and, like, you know, you do it like a boss, because, like, anything you should be doing in this game is bossing it. You shouldn't let the game boss you. Because if you let the game boss you, that's when your keyboard gets smashed into a million pieces, right? You jump over onto this cage, and you jump over to that cage. If you fail, it's no bother. You just try and jump back over here. Then you jump over here, you you know, just give it a few attempts, right? Sometimes you're going to miss this one. That's why you're on here, you can jump up to there. And then with this cage, you just give it multiple tries until you actually get it right. So realistically, you want to do it not too much, but you don't want to do, like, do it too less, or else you'll hit the ceiling like you did there, right? So you jump over, you jump back up through the cage like this, you jump up to this cage, and then you just do a little jump like this. See, that's how you're meant to actually do it. You bounce up here on this hidden platform, bounce under here, now you just take little steps as you go over. Now see, what the mistake is there, what I did wrong, is I didn't do a little step. But at least the snow here is actually your best friend. Because the snow here actually stops you from going all the way back down into the snow section immediately. It's unless you're stupid as I am that you actually drop back down there. So then what you do is you keep jumping over, right? You get back onto the cage. Eventually, once you learn how to actually do the jumps properly. Of course, not everybody's going to be like knowledgeable of how to do this over and over. You don't have the same muscle memory. But I'm doing these mistakes on purpose to just to show you like how it's actually done. Just in case you do mistakes. Now you see, this mistake here, right? You just bounce off that and you can get up here. And then for this, onto the cage, jump over. Then you jump over to here. It might be a bit too much, but it might be grand. It just depends on like how confident you are in that jump. If you're confident in a jump, you'll hit it. But if you're not confident, you won't hit it. It's as simple as that. Now, we're back on this cage section again, right? So we're going to jump up here from the cage. We're going to do a little jump over and then realize eh, it might be just a bit too much. So you just dial it back a little bit, just like that. You jump back up there, you bounce up to the hidden platform, you jump over here, then you do a little jump here, a little jump here, and a little jump here, right? You do a big full jump here, you do a big full jump here, another big full jump here, and if you're good enough, you can actually jump at the same time when you're sliding. But I prefer to just take my time a little bit, because it gets me back into this castle, like the False King's castle, so then we're going to go back up the platforms like so. Now, if you do make a snake, there's like no bother in it, right? You just have to do this, right? And then you jump back up here. The snow is your friend once again, because it's keeping you still, it's keeping you grounded. But of course, you can't be grounded forever. Sometimes you just need to get back out in the world and stop letting things hold you back. So you need to jump up onto the platforms. You miss that, there's no bother. You just bounce off the wall, you get back up there. You go from this platform to this little pillar, to this platform to this little pillar. Now, if you miss it again, no bother. You go slide down, it's all good. You jump back up, you get the snow. He'd say, hey, thank you for support, but I think I'm going to go now. The snow will be very understanding, so, like, you know, the, you shouldn't feel bad about leaving the snow, because at the end of the day, the snow is just there to help support you. It's here to, like, actually just help you out a bit. So then you keep going up like this, right? And then you go over like that. You jump up here. The snow is here to support you once again, because it's a loving little family member that you have. You jump up here. Jump back on the chandelier if you can hit it. But sometimes you just won't be as lucky, so sometimes you can use that little platform to the side I was trying to jump on, but sometimes you're just unlucky, and you just can't hit that hit, like, you know, that jump properly. So then you jump up like this, you jump over here, jump back up, the snow's here to support you once again, chandelier, you pop up here. Now sometimes when this happens, you just bounce back off the chandelier, but I missed it because I was on purposely aiming to show you this platform here, right? You can jump onto here, to jump onto the chandelier here instead, jump onto this one, and then sometimes you'll jump onto the top part of the chandelier, but sometimes you won't. Then you just kind of need to do a little bit of a backwards and forward with this until you actually get onto it like this. Until you get to this platform, you get to this little edge. Now, you're meant to hit that platform in the middle. I'm just showing you this again so that you keep it in your memory banks. Because, you know, if I'm not showing you this multiple times, you're not really going to pay attention during this class. You know how it is. So then you go to that platform, back to this platform. You go to the middle pillar. Then you miss that platform because, you know, we're going to actually do it again. Just to show what I did there, right? Now, that's not what you don't do. I need to show you examples of what you don't do. Because if you do examples 
of like what I don't do, you'll learn that, oh yeah, actually it's meant to be done this way. So you bounce over here, you can bounce back onto this platform, no bother at all, onto this platform, onto this pillar, onto this platform, onto this pillar, back up here, and now you're onto the like Underberg section. Now this section is probably going to be your best friend because it has something called wind, right? And you use that wind to your advantage to jump over and around, right? So then you get back up to here somewhere like this, and you just have to be a bit patient with it because if you're not patient with it, you're actually going to probably commit suicide, and that's not really nice. So you're going to have to jump over like this, you pop up like this, then you do a little bouncy on the wall. Sometimes you'll hit this platform, sometimes you won't. It's okay. That's why the other platform's there to help support you if you don't make it, but I made it that time, so we're going to go here. And sometimes if you're a bit bored, you can just hop up to this one if you're really feeling a bit good. And then sometimes you just pop over to here, and then you can pop up to here. Sometimes you can do it from down there as well to jump up onto this next platform, but you know. I'm going to just show you, right? You do a full one up to here, and you just wait again. That's the unfortunate part about Underberg, is just you're waiting so long for the wind to change. Then you do this little jump, which helps get you into the tower 100% of the time if you aim it right. Now, see, I'm doing that on purpose to show you. If you don't hit that spot properly, you won't be able to do that. But if you're a boss like me, you'll hit it like that, and you get onto that platform. Now, you won't get onto that platform immediately again. As I said, it's a weird jump. Sometimes it works, and sometimes it doesn't. But when the wind slows down, you can just use that platform instead. And as I said before, you just have to wait. And again, I just need to clear the saliva from my mouth because I'm talking too much for you to actually keep up with this, I assume. But, you know, there's no harm in just constantly giving commentary about what I'm doing because, you know, again, if I'm pissed off, I'm probably going to smash my keyboard. And if I stop talking, you're going to hear keys flying around my room. And I don't really fancy buying a new keyboard right this second, so I'd rather not do that. And I'd have to use my other keyboard anyway, which isn't really a gaming keyboard, so I'd actually have to go out tomorrow and buy one. So that's why I'm kind of still talking. You bounce off here again. Again, see, look. That's two for two. Nearly 100% chance there. Well, basically 100% chance there. And then you just bounce up the tower like this. Like, anywhere there's a wall, you just bounce onto it and you get to the next platform. For this one, you bounce and or you jump up and you go backwards. And then you just take it easy. You take it patiently, right? Then you jump over like this. You jump up like this. And once again, you kind of just have to do a little bounce against the wall if you're stuck in there. But then you just have to wait for the wind, you jump like this, you get onto the platform, and sometimes you can do a little bit less of a jump, but I prefer the full jump because it guarantees it. Do a full jump here, you jump at this spot here, because if you leave it too late, you're going to hit the thing just there. But if you leave it too early, you most likely won't make it up. Then you hop over like this, you wait for the wind again, you hop over like this, and then you make it here. Now this is actually a better one I prefer, because uh, someone there was mentioning that this is a better jump. You do a full send into the wall there, you get straight up here. Do a full send over that way. Do a little bit of a jump over here. And you get back up to Frontier. Now with Frontier, this one's a bit tricky because there's a lot of slopes around. It's actually going to fuck you over more than that, eh, more than your mother being fucked in the ass by your dad. So what you're going to have to do is actually just be a bit patient with it. Because sometimes it might just take a bit of time to actually get past this. Especially with all the slopes that do mad stuff here. See, like right there I could have slipped but I was lucky enough to just touch the platform. But sometimes the pixels just don't align and they just don't allow it. And then sometimes the slope is your best friend. See, this slope is probably the best slope in the game. Game because it actually puts you back to where you want to be not like the other slopes where like if you like hit it at the wrong angle you could fall all the way back down to the king's false keep and that's no bueno so what you're gonna have to do again is just jump back up here you jump over here and again this is this kind of ties back into that like slope example where it's like if you're just not good with slopes these slopes will be a bitch to you but you know what you just have to get over it Suck your thumb if you need to, if it helps clear, like with your coping mechanism. But remember to have another hand free so you can actually, you know, play the game itself. Unless you just need a few seconds to chill, which is just fair, you know? Because sometimes you're at the game for absolute hours and then it's just like fucking bonkers. Then you're just literally hitting your head against the wall for the last 29 hours and 12 minutes. And you're wondering to yourself, man, why haven't I even made any progress? But that's the joys of Jump King, right? It's not about... The you progressing as fast as possible. It's about the friends you make along the way. That's why, like, these NPCs, they stay there. They give you a little bit of a story because they know you're going to see them every single time you come back here. And if they weren't there, then it'd be a pretty boring journey, to be honest. It wouldn't even really be a journey, would it? If you're not being constantly harassed by different NPCs about their backstories, you know? Now, see, this is the jump I hate the most because it's just sometimes you just get really unlucky with it. So you're just kind of going to have to keep going, keep doing it, full send here. Not really full send here, it's a, like kind of a little jump because sometimes you can go over it. And sometimes if you do a full send there, you'll just go fall like face first anyway. So there's really no point in it. 
but for the best results you probably should just not like doubt yourself during these jumps or else the slopes will punish you for your doubt like trust me i'm going to show you in a minute here probably now about how doubtful it is like or how much i doubt myself with these slopes here because if i hit the slope wrong it'll hit another slope and sometimes i'll just could be flying down but as i said this slope right here is your literal best friend like i know you might have a best friend irl and your besties and you have that necklace thing that's like half a hair and half another hair but fuck that shit like that slope is true friendship down there if i were to choose to fuck someone right now it probably would be that slope that slope has saved me so many times from restarting this section that i can't thank it enough for the amount of times it saved me i've lost track of how many times it saved me it's just a natural thing the slope does it just it does it out of generosity it doesn't even ask for anything in return other than you know hey you know if you're still like going through make sure to hop on to me and i'll help you back up you know that's really the only like thing the slope really likes about you and it's like you know you should really appreciate that because once you reach the top you don't get to see that fella anymore that fella's just gone you don't have to ever visit him ever again unless you're fucking stupid enough to actually do another like run of the game unless you're doing a speed run then that's fair but like why would you torture yourself twice over that's like buying two cars and paying two mortgages like that's just no sensical like and see sometimes as i said there if you hit the slope wrong you're just gonna fall down so now we're gonna have to just do all that again and continue going from there so you see what i did what you shouldn't do there is hit that ceiling because if you hit that ceiling it can go wrong sometimes but i was just showing it there as an example because you know i need to show a lot of examples or else we're not just going to learn anything during the stream at all now you hit this there we go three for three 100% success rate. What am I saying? Now, up we go. We go back up to here. And we just, again, we just keep hitting the walls. If you keep hitting the walls at full, like, strength, you'll be able to make it up. Now, I don't know what happens here if you do full uh, jump. But, you know, that's for you to try in your own time. That's why, like, everybody here, like, you know, if you're interested in the game, make sure to buy it. Because it's a fucking good game. As much as I hate the shit out of this game, it is a really good game. And I actually can't recommend it enough. It is definitely worth your value if you're looking for a game that just wants to, like, you know, use your time nicely. If you like a game that lasts a long time and has barely any mechanics to make it last more than five minutes, this is your game. And now, as you can see, we're popping over. Almost slipped there on the slope. See, again, I have to keep reiterating this. The slopes are not your friend here, except the one above. The one above is literally your best friend. You should probably actually just completely just bury your family underground alive because they're probably not going to live up to the standards of the slope that you have right now in this game. Like, I'm just being perfectly honest with you. And honestly, that's just my opinion as well. Now, what I did there was stupid. But as you can see, when you try and full send a jump whilst it's windy, it kind of just sends you back to where you were. So sometimes you don't have to worry about it unless the wind is changing direction. And what I did there was also wrong as well. If I stay too close to the edge, I could slip down the slope. And if I slip down the slope, see, this shit happens. You just slide down. And not all the time will you be lucky to actually be able to be saved by the actual like tower itself. The tower is also a good friend, but I wouldn't count them as your best friend. The tower is kind of just a friend that's, like, just handy to, like, talk to on an odd time, but I wouldn't, like, go to them for my troubles. I'd obviously go to the slope back in the frontier place and then talk to them about my troubles. Now, if you don't mind, I'm just going to take a little sip of water before we continue here because my throat is actually going to collapse in on itself. It's just like, I have to, I had to fucking stop. Jesus Christ, my throat, man. <laughs> I just, I'm literally opening my flask again. <sighs> what hour are we in on the stream? I need to rewatch that. Like, I need to rewatch and see how long I fucking did that, man. Uh... Again, it's so weird, right? I'm literally bashing my head against the wall, but I'm having such a fucking fun time just doing it. Like, I don't know why. It's so fucking stupid, like. Maybe I'm a bit buzzed. Maybe that's why I'm having so much fun. Ah. Oh, no, that's good. Now that things have... I think I mainly was doing that because I was just... I was literally going insane. If I didn't get out of that snow section during the stream, I actually probably would just, like, cry. I would probably break down. 
It wouldn't even be the first time I've cried on stream, to be honest. I did cry once before in, um, I think it was like The Walking Dead and New Frontier or something like that. It was the one that where, like, Clementine wasn't the main. It was, yeah, no, it was the third season. I think it was just like, oh no, it might have been season two. Because there's, like, a certain character that just, like, that something happens to him, basically, and I was just getting really emotional over it. Even now, I let fucking games dictate my emotions, I swear to god, like. Ah, uh, dead this way. Oh, I do that every single time, and it literally does not even get old. Hey, bestie. <laughs> oh, fuck's sake! Okay, wait, 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 I can make it. Impatience, impatience? Let's go, Pog. You know, the funniest thing is, if you stream on kick and stream in a certain category, you could probably take it over. <laughs> but then again, I think everyone's on kick now are just going to stream in the just chatting section because that's where XQC is. And once he goes off, they think, oh, maybe like their viewers will funnel back down to us. Like, I don't think that'll work like that, though, to be honest. I think once the Juicer's King is down, then like we're off for today, the then they're not really going to do much else. Yeah, no, fair play for him, honestly, taking that fucking deal. I think someone else was saying as well, I don't know if it's confirmed or not, but I think he said he's retiring as well. Which, you can't even really doubt him, honestly. Uh, we're talking about the 100 mil deal with XTC. Yeah, that's the, um, that's the latest fucking news with Kick and stuff. I was just saying, like, fair play to him for taking it, honestly. And I think he also said he was kind of retiring as well. But I think it's like retiring in the sense of PewDiePie retiring, where it's like, you're not trying to do like stuff on the internet as hard anymore. You kind of you just you just exist. And honestly, it's been a good thing for like PewDiePie. That's two Felixes that have like fucking retired. Like, but yeah. How are you doing otherwise? Um, Steve, a <laughs> piece of Steve. That's why I read your name as. No, it's Pie of Steve. There you go. When I get my brain cells in order. Oh, thanks for following us as well. I'm gonna have to do another random number generator thing to see what game we play next. I already did it before, but like the count kind of went down again, so I have the excuse of just <laughs> spinning for another game. Cause last time it was so much fun. Cause like last time, um, I started playing this game called The Captain, and like it was genuinely actually like a pretty decent game. So I'm gonna do it again and see what new game we come across. And maybe not avoid the poker one this time, because I think you can still play simulated poker, but you just can't play um, gambling poker. Even though I feel like it would be boring, though, to be honest. Yeah, random number generator. So, like, we're going to go um, random number generate and see, like, which, um, whatchamacallit, which game it lands, or not game, which number it lands on. And then I count in my epic games list from A to Z, you know, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. And then whatever number we land on is how many times I count down, and whatever game we land on is the game we play uh, for next stream. So it probably won't be this stream because I'm just so fucking tired right now. THANK YOU FOR FUCK'S SAKE! HOLY SHIT! I'm sorry, I had to get that out, oh my god. I've been here for 2 hours and 52 minutes to get back to this fucking section run, oh my god. Sorry that I put that all on you just there for a minute. <laughs> just like, just literally just screams out of nowhere. Like, I'm sorry, I have that effect on people. Because I think I scared um, Alex last time or something like that. But you don't know the fucking pent up fucking anger I had within me. And what I've been through for the last two hours and 53 minutes. <laughs> like, I was literally like... I swear I was actually non-stop commentating for a full 10 minutes about what I was doing in the game because I just didn't want to smash my keyboard in. This is the effect Jump King has on me, but at the same time it's funny because I'll still- Oh yeah, I forgot, I can't do that. But I'll still love this game. I'll still play it anyway. <laughs> Even if I hate it to fucking bits, like... But anyway, um, follower goals, games, yeah, so I need to do that soon. I might- if I fucking fall back down, I will probably quit Jump King for today, but at least I'll, um... I'll do the number generator thing here in the stream before I go off for today. I think I should do that at the very least. Okay, where is it? There it is, that's it. But yeah, um, oh god, how low is your sanity? 
Um, if we were playing Phasmophobia, I might need to take more than just one set of pills, to be honest. But that's just my own opinion. Oh, for fuck's sake, I've forgotten how to do up here. Oh my god. Oh my god. You know, I'm just, I'm, I can't even be mad anymore. I'm just happy I'm finally fucking here. I set this to be the goal of the fucking stream to get back up here, and I'm actually up here three hours later, like. It's ridiculous the amount of hours you pour into the game, but it's so satisfying when you do it right. Uh, I think if I jump here, it should be okay. Yeah, there we go. Hello, Mountain King. How are you doing? Oh my god, the, oh wait. Muscle memory's kind of kicking in right now. But it's not entirely. There you go. So in other words, fucking god awful. Yeah. That that is exactly it. Oh, but this is probably gonna be even more worse. Can I at least reach the black sanctuary and then stop for a minute and then do the random number generator yoke? I think I should do that at the very least. Even though I said I'd stop the stream after I've done the moss or got back to the moss section. Nope, too early. Oh my god, okay, no, that's gonna take some time to get back used to, honestly. Ah, wait, no, we're good. Huh. I like the emotes, by the way. I see, like, the lurk and all that, and the, um, the bop, 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 bop. Yeah, no. If I didn't fear balding, I probably would have like torn some of my hair out by now. But to be fair, like with me, like and balding, I don't really. It's not really much of an issue right now. But like, I see my brother balding, and I'm like, bro, no, please, don't happen to me now. Give me a few more years at the very least, like. That's my femme boyfriend. Ah, CC. I too once was a uh, fanboy for a few streams. <laughs> oh my god, okay. Uh, and then it's not full here. Yeah, it's like that. I think it's this way? Yeah, it's that way. And then I think I hit... Oh, fuck! Okay, no, I missed it. That was such a cursed error now that I think about it. For a few. Yeah. Because like, with follower goals, it customizes the stream. So sometimes it'll be a game I play, sometimes it'll be... Like a layout kind of thing on the stream that changes. And sometimes you'll be able to change bits of my model over time. Last time I went like full like just pink outfit. And basically I tried to give off a fanboy vibe. Or at least what I envisioned was a fanboy like a uh, vibe. Um, Do I have the picture of it? I should have a screenshot of it somewhere. Just give me an uno memento. Because I need an excuse to stop playing Jump King for a minute here. <laughs> Just like, I need to restore my sanity, even if it's by 0.1% like, percent every 5 minutes. Like, um, Where is Twitch? There it is. Yeah, yeah, take a breather. Yeah. You love fanboys, yeah. Um, VTuber PNGs. And then if I ever... I'm going to show this one first. Um... Let me see. So I need to do that. And then I need to just hide this for a minute. That's what I looked like basically for seven streams. And I didn't have the post-it note on my head all the time. But sometimes I do put it on my head because I think it's funny. Ugh. But yeah, I threw in the cat ears. The um, heart. I uh, can't remember the name of it properly. The sparkle eyes. It's basically like a combination of follower goals that I used to make it. And there was a full dress and all for it and all. Um, I could redon it, but like I don't really want to redon it right now. <laughs> I I will stop. Like I will not wear it for a while. I think like it's going to be a nerf follower goal at some point. Um, actually, let me. I need to show the cursed one as well, because like it's basically that, but it's just um, you know, you'll have nightmares after looking at it. That's so cute. Thank you. I did try. Uh, let's see. Oh god, now I see stuff in my watch later playlist and I want to add it, like. <laughs> oh no, that's sad. I'm sorry, I just see a like title on YouTube that says Xbox explains why they didn't show Halo. 
that's not boding well for the future of Halo. Um, if I go on to Twitter, I think, um, Mappa. Wait, where, where does Mappa come in? Did you actually just see my screen there? It should be Jump King, isn't it? Or are you actually somehow seeing my screen right now? How so? Let me just full screen for a minute. <laughs> just, just in case. Unless it just came through on the stream, the stream glitched out and showed my page. I saw the Halo thumbnail. Wait, do you see the Twitch right now? Or the Twitter? Because it should be showing Jump King, it shouldn't be showing this. I want to make it a surprise. Actually, you know what, there, there we go, now we're making this proper surprise. Oh, but wait, how far back is it, Joe? Fuck, I never even thought about that. Okay, hold on, I need to use the, uh... Oh, how... Oh! I see a glimpse to where now it's gone, okay, yeah. That's weird, I didn't even know that. I thought, like, once Jump King was prioritized as a screen, it wouldn't show thing yet. Gotta keep that in mind. Um... Whatchamacallit. Oh, that's it. I need to go to Clips channel. Because I think the Clips channel will have the clip. Actually, Twitch. Literally, Twitch has the clip, Joe. You're on the platform right now. Why not use it? <laughs> Joe. Joe. Thank you, me, for nearly making a rap. Um, ba -ba 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 Videos. I love how cursed that looks. It's just like, with clips, it's literally just like, the first few things you see, uh, let me actually use the main scene instead. You just fucking see, like, shirtless, shirtless, and then just head below the fucking banner, like. That's so cursed, like. Um, videos. I think I smell popcorn. I just caught a glimpse of it there. Um, mum, 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 mum. Oh, where was it? I think it was just a clip. I don't think it was a highlight. I mean, to be fair, actually, yeah, actually, if I looked it on YouTube, it'd probably be faster. Because I really just want to show this. Just to show how cursed the fucking, like, fanboy model got at one stage before I finalized it. Um, let's see. Clips. Uh, da -da -da -da. this is the clips. And then I just type in... Actually, I wouldn't even know what to type in. I can't remember what I called it. But it's... Oh, there it is. Yeah, uh, I don't know if you... Actually, let me just show it. Uh, let me show the... Oh. <laughs> it's not that bad. It's this here. If you see that there. Look how fucking cursed that is. Just staring at your fucking soul. like. And I even did it with that fucking model as well. Like the uh, blonde oh, model. I'll show you again. And I'll slow it down, because I'm a weirdo. I watch all my videos really fast. Look, look, right? Pay attention. Exactly, right? Like, bro, <coughs> I, I'm not even going to put that as a follow goal. I don't even want this anymore. I want to make sure to turn this shit off, like... Oh, oh yeah, it was this one. Ambient occlusion. There we go. I have that shit like turned all. The oh way wait, did around. I? I fucking. I do never. I'd never want to see that again. Bro, that's fucking clickbait. I just. I literally just clickbaited myself. What? No. Wait. I want to see the thing. No way did I actually just clickbait myself. Where? That's also cursed. Where? Well, it is. It's the thumbnail. But like. I must have... I'm so confused with that. Hold on, let me just... No, wait. No, I swear... No, it, no, it was a clip. I swear there was a separate clip for that. Nah, this is actually going to drive me insane if I don't... Okay, no, it's not that one. It's not that one. Maybe I didn't. Hmm, tink, tink, images. It must be on my Twitter somewhere. Not this one, that's just new. I still can't believe that I actually clickbaited myself. Oh, I should have checked how old the thing was so I know what date I'm looking for. To be fair though, the fanboy model like phase, I don't think that lasted too long. Ooh. Uh, that's teaser. I'm only human after all. I'm only human. 
After all, don't put the blame on me. Ah, there's a version of it. Ah, that, that, yeah, there we go. Oh, can I actually full screen this? There we go. There's a version of it. Just on Twitter. I don't know. It, there must have been a clip of it somewhere, but I just can't remember what it is. This is like what it looks. <laughs> oh, God, go back. Go back to the way it was. Put it away. Monstrosity. You know, funny enough, I actually kind of want to bring that back as a follower goal. It's just anyone that joins, they're just like, what the fuck? Are you okay? Do, do you need help? Why do you look so dark? Do, do you need some, like, you know, Jesus? Do you need a cross? Do you need a, a prayer to be sung? Or, like, are you good? Right, out of that. Uh, I've taken me a little break now. Back into the king of jumping. Um, you look like you've seen many things. Oh, that's your one from, uh, um, uh, Squid Games, that's it. I remember when people were going mad over Squid Games back then. It is pretty good, though, the show. I have to say. Okay, I have to be... Actually, I think I'm... I, I, I'll, yeah, I'll be grand. <laughs> I say I'll be grand, but I just pop back down here just for a little visit, like. Oh, yeah, wait, I could just walk through here. I forgot about that. I do love this emote. Yeah, I'd love to like um, which we call it. See that emote being used more often. Just e just anything you say from now on. It's like, oh man, you're doing pretty good in the game, and just that emote. <laughs> Notice how I'm fluffing myself up in advance as well. Right now, th this should be this should be cake. I say that as I'm failing. I'm scared to honestly drop back down to fucking um thingy section. I really don't want to drop back down to the fucking like, Lost Frontier. If I drop back down to Lost Frontier, it's game over. Like, I'm never getting back up here in another fucking few hours. It took me three hours basically to get here, like. I won't be looking forward to the next three hours when it takes me long. <laughs> nice job, keep going. <laughs> I love it because it kind of radiates, like, sarcasm. Like, when you do it like that. Oh, fuck. It's like the, um, it's like the blank face smile emoji. That's like default on Twitch. I like when people use that one as well. Oh, fuck. Okay, there we go. We're, we're, we're gone. We're done. 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 We are done. Yeah, it radiates such sarcasm. I love it. Okay, it's not game over yet, boys. Let's go. Yeah, see, this is my problem with Jump King. I don't know when to quit. I just keep going. I keep thinking, ah, oh, no, this time it'll be different. We'll actually be able to fucking do it. <laughs> Let's go! Let's go! I don't know if I'm showing a blank face. I think I'm smiling too much for it to show a blank face. Right, back up. Thank you. <laughs> Let's go! God, fucking, oh my god, my desk is so warm. That's how, that's how you can tell it's like a hot day, I've been gaming a lot, and my PC is running at 60 uh, degrees. I really need to fucking put thermo paste into my fucking computer soon, or else it's probably gonna combust like. Um, looking dead into my eyes, I can do it, uh, do it too. Oh yeah, with the emote, yeah. Ha 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 ha! Just, like, redoing that meme from the Far Cry 5 ad, I think it was. The, um, voice actor, or not voice actor, the actor that does, um, or plays as Gustavo. My name is Gustavo, but people call me Gus. Gerd Los Polos y Manos. Oh, gee, oh, no, no, that's, uh, that's actually scarier than what I thought. It was. I thought you were going to just use the other emo. Fucking hell. It's Obama! I just read there the fucking thing. Ulama. Il Illumina. Illumi. 144 Obama. So Illuminati Obama. Or 144 Obama, like. Bruh. I shouldn't even be surprised that it's an edit of Obama, like. 
As much as I hate to admit, I've been watching a lot of um, the President AI is just singing songs and stuff, and it's just it's a gas scenario just to think of like the like former presidents all like playing games with each other. Well, not all former, obviously, because of Biden's in uh, U.S. office, whatever terminology you use. I don't know. I'm not American, but yeah. Well, if you tell you. What if I tell you it's unedited? There's no way that's unedited. That looks like it's been dark and like... <laughs> unless that's just what you see if you um don't like... Uh, what was it? I think Obamacare or something like that. I don't know. Uh, if you don't support Obamacare, uh, I'll stare at you. Yeah, it's not. Bro, no way. Back on this episode or Factor Cap. Apparently that is fact. You can tell TikTok still rotted a part of my brain. So I think that's like a TikTok thing, isn't it? The factor cap trend. Or not trend, but like someone was saying those things before. I honestly love how I do this section and I'm just like, I'm not really even paying too much attention anymore. I'm doing the same mistake over and over because I'm just on fucking, I'm just on autopilot. That's just how it is. Um, Factor cap. Okay, no, two more. No, that's good. That's good. That's good. Redemption! It's redemption time. It's actually redemption time. Red Dead 3 just got announced. Not really. I lied. Don't believe everything you hear on the internet. I've not even ever played any of the Resident Evil, or not Resident Evil, the Red Dead Redemption games. I just heard the horse testicles are like animated pretty well or some shit like that. <sighs> oh yeah, wait, why am I bouncing that way? Okay, this is the scary part now. I'm gonna read your message and then I'm gonna have to go silent a little bit. If you fall, you become a femboy once again. Suddenly the follower goal... Actually, is the follower goal even in thing? Is it even in rotation? I say in rotation because with follower goals, there have been ones that are benched. Because some of them I've just, like, encountered too much. And it's just like, ah, oh, well, I'm, I kind of want to let some of these other ones breathe, you know? Hold on, let me just see a minute here. Donate. Uh, let me just use F3 Femboy. Ah, oh, it's benched. Unfortunately, it's benched. Unless you want the curse Femboy. We can always do the curse Femboy follower goal. That can always work. Right, silent. Or I'm. Oh wait, sorry. Let me show the screen again. I'm going to on purpose ignore you just for a minute until I fall. Okay, I've fallen. I'm not ignoring you. But then once I step back onto this pillar properly, then I'm going to have to concentrate again. Because I think I got pretty up far like in this section, and then the great fall happened, and then I fucking cried that night. Bro, look out! The doubt! The doubt! The actual fucking doubt in this man right now. Holy shit! Just do it! Oh my god! Okay, see there! Is that hurt? Exactly! <laughs> you got this. Thank you, thank you. I know, I'm, I'm good. I'm good at fucking up. I know, thank you. I'm being sarcastic, by the way. <laughs> I'm not actually being, like, mad or anything. It won't be fair for me to be mad at something that, like, nobody, like, did to me. This is all me. Me playing the game. And I've set up systems for people to, uh, do thing with. The, especially the fucking sound alerts. Once the sound alerts started coming into play, just... Oof. Um, oh yeah, this way. And I think it is a funnier, like, uh, thing to have the uh, sound alerts. I gotta customize them a bit more, though. I do know my mate played the metal pipe falling sound and I actually just gushed over how good it was. I just, I don't know why, I'm just, I, I just love that sound. Ah, <laughs> oh, for fuck's sake. At least I'm here. And now I'm down here. Never mind, I lied. See, you prey on your downfall in advance so that if you don't, like, go down, then you can blame yourself. Or not blame yourself, you can prove yourself wrong. There it is. 
literally scared the shit out of me. Even though I literally saw out of the corner of my eye, like the fucking sound thing playing. Oh my god, okay. Like the actual logo for the sound alert playing. Which sometimes bugs out. I swear, like, sometimes when I'm watching a VOD back, I won't see it. And I don't even know why. Unless I've just accidentally hidden the source on other, um, whatchamacallit, uh, other thingies. Names escape my head. <laughs> we love metal pipes. <laughs> I like the emoji as well. You know, fuck all that, like, cocoa melon stuff. If we just, like, gave kids, like, a tablet and just an hour of non-stop playing of the metal pipe falling sound... Like, kids would actually just learn that, like, there's more to life than just, you know, being a kid. Like, you know? They grow up faster. They get a job faster. They'd actually contribute to society. That'd be nice. And I can actually chat this shit because I have a job. <laughs> now, as whereas before, if I said something like this, I'd say, but then again, I don't even work myself, so. Okay, uh, I think it's up this way, isn't it? No, okay, so it's not that way. I just can't, I legit just can't remember because it's been so long since I've been up here. Since last I've seen my son lost to this monster. For the man behind the slaughter. It's been so long since I've been singing this stupid song. Lost to this monster. For the man behind the slaughter. The fucking FNAF song from the Living's Tombstone are just bangers. No one can convince me otherwise. Like all of them, not even just like, not even just the first five or like anything like that. Like all. Actually, no. To be fair, I can't even remember the security breach one. But I do know it exists. I know that much. The man behind the slaughter. Aha! <laughs> wouldn't it be fun, my fellow Americans? Wouldn't it be so funny if I was just a man behind the slaughter? No! It's 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 game over. It's game over. I'm calling it now. It's game over. It's legitimately game over, and there's nothing I can do about this. Okay, it's not game over. Let's go. We're still going. At least for the. Probably 11 minutes or so. Because I actually have to go soon. Because I can't be making this much noise when my uh, brother's going to be going to sleep soon. Because I hate to be that guy. Because I know when I'm sleeping and I hear big noise. Jesus Christ. I, how did dick scare me more than the metal pipe sound? <laughs> I thought I had a Shy Lily stream on on the side. Like... Um, fucking, whatchamacallit. Fucking, um... You know, I know when I'm sleeping, I don't really like to, like, hear shit at night. That's because, like, I'm a light sleeper. Like, you could literally just be in front of my house, and I would just wake up knowing you're in front of my house, like. God, now I'm pairing that with the fucking imagery of the Obama staring emote, like. That's gonna be fun. Wait, did you actually just post blank? It's just, it's blank, but it takes up two spaces and thing. Oh, yeah, so it's literally an emote that's nothing. Oh, that's another emote idea I could use as well. Literally just fucking blank. Because on Kick, um, I was uploading some emotes. Like, if I ever do use Kick, that is. At least I have some emotes I can use. But, um, that's another idea. Just having a transparent image is a fucking thing. Just to troll people being like, Oh, why is my shit not loading? Why is chat not loading? Oh, no, that's creeps. Nah, that's another emo I have. Uh, yeah, it's funny. But it's just like, yeah. It's funny. I'm too buzzed up today, I swear to God. Like, honestly, this stream could have been totally different. I was going to start off with fucking Genjin Impact or Honkai. A game's like I've barely played in a while. I was like, you know what, I'm going to suffer through Jump King instead, but I've been just having too much of a blast here. <laughs> just... Again, I don't even know if I'm replicating that right, but I did change the, um... What should we call it? The facial expression setting. So that the, um... More expressions can come back again. 
I did shut it off for a bit because I thought it'd be better, but I think it's worse when I don't allow my, um, like, the experimentation of the, uh, expressions to show themselves. Oh my god. It's painful every time I drop like that. Because all I need to do is this. And then this. This. Hop up here. I did see a pog face. Honestly, even as simple as that, I should just take, like, screenshots that I already have. Because I have, like, a whole library of PNGs of, like, VTuber models I've worn over time. Because I make a lot of thumbnails, and I need to use them again in thumbnails. And I've just saved them over time. I should make a lot of those into emotes for... Uh, kick. I just need to shove them all into a project file that's 500 by 500. Uh, the thing is, your model uh, just looks naturally dead. To be fair, yeah, it's probably the eye bags. Because, like, I do kind of have eye bags IRL. That's why I have eye bags on the um, model. They're not as profound as the ones on my model, but they are there. I do notice them. And, um... Whatchamacallit. I know, like, I think there's a follower goal for it where it's like... Why do I keep doing that? Anyway. Um, after a certain amount of followers, I'm gonna actually take them off permanently now. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god, me too. Twinsies. Let's go! I would say sleep de- well, actually, yeah, no, kind of sleep deprived, gang. Cause like, it's fucking hard to sleep in Ireland when it's this weather, man. It's like, I'm literally sleeping on the outside of the bed, but I'm still warm. It's honestly the worst. And I wake up really early in the morning, cause ever since I started work, I think I have, like, an innate fear, like, inside me that, oh shit, what if I'm not just woken up this morning and I miss work, you know? So that's why now I wake up, like, probably at, I'd say I'd w roughly wake up at, like, 6 o'clock or something. When, on a weekend, I don't even need to get up until, like, well, any time of one. And I don't even need to get up for work until, uh, 7 o'clock, so. Okay, no, I'd rather that. I'd honestly rather fall down there than not fall down there. My heart can't take much more of this. But we're nearing the end of the stream, so it won't be too long. Oh yeah, I need to do the random number generator thing as well. I need to remember to do that before I head off. And plus, my throat is honestly kind of just... I can feel it, like, wanting to give up so badly because I haven't fucking, like, stopped talking. Or haven't talked this much in a while. And it's weird, right? Because I'll go out with mates and I'll talk to them. But I won't feel the same effect of, like, what's in my throat. Like, for some reason, it's just like, when I'm on stream, and I'm actually chatting up a fucking storm, even just to myself, it'll just affect me heavily. Maybe it's the warm room. But anyway, two days ago, I went to bed at 4am, and yesterday I went to bed at 3am. Help. Ah. Uh, unfortunately... Oh, shit. I don't know any advice what I could give about sleeping that late um, in the morning, I, you might as well just say at that point, but... For me, the reason I go to bed at, like, around 11 o'clock... It's because, like, the whole house goes to bed, and, like, if I'm up all night clanking on my keyboard, that can probably be heard, so I never stay up after 11, really. I just, like, once it's 11, I hit my bed, and if I don't sleep... Jesus. Oh, scared me again. Um, if I don't sleep, then... Or if I don't sleep immediately, then I'll just wait until I sleep. Because even half the time when I try to go to sleep, I won't actually be asleep until, like, probably, I'd assume, after 12 or 1. Especially if I have a lot of thoughts on my mind as well. Like, not even bad thoughts, just like a lot of curious thoughts, like. But yeah. I love, I just wanted to say I love dicks, Lamau. A connoisseur of the dicks. I would not know myself, I don't actually like dicks. I do possess one, but unfor that is unfortunate. And to be fair, it is a good fucking sound alert. That's why I've robbed it off fucking Shia Lily, because it's just so good. Oh my... I'm... I'm do. I do. I'm very gay. Yup. Oh my god! Then you can do it as many times as you want. Especially while, like, the thing is free. Because I don't think I'll ever, like, charge for them, unless, like, maybe if for whatever reason of, like, sound alerts being abused in the future, then maybe I'd consider it. Just be like, okay, if you fuckers really want to spam this one, here you go, here's a payment, like, 
Money. I want money now. Money! So, Mr. Krabs, why did you uh, lock that uh, sound alert behind a paywall? Money! Oh my god. But yeah, to be fair though, I'm, I should really um, disable the fucking donation thing at some point. Because I already have a job. I'm already, like, kind of sound, honestly, for money. I don't really need it, like. It's just kind of there for the funsies, like. And it has happened before, but I have... I think I... Did I change... No, TTS has changed for the Twitch alert. So that follower goal alert, if I had TTS on, you'd hear... I don't know if you know this TTS, but it's called TTS Brian. Such a legend in the streaming space. He kind of talks like this a bit. And he's very, um... He's a male one. I can't remember... An example of him would be, well, actually on most streams. Yeah, yeah, I do. Yeah, no, he his voice would play for certain, um, whatchamacallit, Twitch alerts that I have. Oh, my God. That's actually the appropriate place to play that as well. Because I feel like this place would have a metal, like, pipe falling somewhere. I mean, there's literally a metal pipe in the background, like. What time we are? Okay, no, we still have, like, 15 minutes. Even though I said, like, ages ago we have 11 minutes. Ignore that. Okay, I see what I'm doing, but I don't commit to it. I see what I'm doing, but I don't commit to it. I see what I'm doing, but I'm committing to it. I'm committing to it. I am committing to it. Fuck. I shouldn't have committed to it. <sighs> Ooh, you got some more in you. I do. I think if I tell myself these things, what I'm doing them, I do better. Not all the time, though. Because I feel like I'm going to overstep this jump up here. Actually, you know what? Fuck this. I'm stopping this here. No. No, 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 no. I... Now me saying that, I'm going to fall down the side, and I'm going to actually fucking fall down Frontier, through Underberg, through the King's Keep, try to get back up, fall down into the slope of ice, slip down there, get down there, and fucking just, yes, the keyboard will finally be smashed. Anyway, I'm not going yet, because I need to do the, um, uh, what you call it, I need to do the, uh, uh, roll, the, the, not dice, uh, the number generator thing. You are the greatest! Uh, what? No, only idiots would do that. Well, only idiots would, uh, make a mistake in Jump King, or only idiots would go off today. I'm sorry to say, but my throat is actually killing me, so I have to go. Um, but first, as I said, though, we need to do the number generator thing, so I'm going to do that first. Number gen generator? There it is. Okay, so I need... Okay, firstly, I need to actually open Epic Games, and then I need to count how many um... Games I have first and foremost. Just give me a second, because for some reason Epic and uh, well, it's just Epic actually takes their time to open a bit. Uh, it was fun being here for a little bit. Thanks for joining us, honestly. Bye. I really had fun talking. Like, um, right. Let's see. Library. Seven installed, but how many? There's one filter. <laughs> Types. Okay, wait, yeah, types. So do we have software, digital extras, and games? There's 158 games. So I need to plug in 158. First we generate just to make sure it knows that there's 158. Yeah, 158 games on um, Epic uh, Store. You'll see in a minute when I'm counting through them. Uh, well, actually, you won't, because I'm going to count them off stream first, and then once I land on one, I'll show you what it is. Anyway. Uh, so... We're going to spin it. I say spin it, but I'm literally just going to click generate and it's the thing. <laughs> I hope I get 69. Right. Three, two, one. Really? 14. We, we could have gone up to the hundreds, but no, we just went down to 14. That's actually kind of disappointing. I'm, I'm annoyed at that. Right. Um, actually, you know what? Should... <laughs> Not even close. I, I won't go by recently played or recently purchased. Actually, yeah, time would be bad as well. You know, I'll let you choose, Pi. Do you want to go from A to Z or Z to A? I'd never really say Z. Z to A or A to Z. 
this is like sorting the games in order, depending on which one. So I'll either be going 14 down or 14 up. Take your pick. A to Z. Let's go. Okay, A to Z. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. That's 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. Okay, I'm going to be honest with you. I wish I could play the Bioshock game, but I haven't played the other games yet. And I think you kind of understand if you want, like, if you don't mind me re-rolling on this one. Because, uh, let me just show it. So we went, uh, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, right? And it landed on Bioshock. And at the same time, Bioshock kind of fucks around with OBS because of its aspect ratio, at least the older ones. So, I'm gonna do a little respin. Sorry, I, I know that seems like an excuse, but my, at least my last excuse had a reason. Because last time I landed on the, uh, poker game. <laughs> Another chance to get 69. Last time I landed on a poker game, and I was actually being like, oh shit, can we even play this on Twitch? But I learned later, yeah, you can play on Twitch, it's just because it's virtual. Right. Here's the 69. 45. <laughs> That's you falling off your chair, like, when you realize it's fucking 45 and not 69. Another disappointing number, but we'll say, right, 45. 1, 2, 3. Wait, no. 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, what is this? I don't like RNG. Unfortunately, to make it interesting, we have to do like a little bit of RNG aspect. I wish I could make it more exciting by having it in a spin wheel, but I'm not sitting here for ages putting 158 games into the wheel like... Hold on, I need to check out what the fuck this game even is. And make sure I can actually play it on stream, actually. Actually, wait, hold on. That's the first check, actually. Let me type the name into the bar X. Let's see. Yeah, no, it's on Twitch, so I can play it. Because, like, if, like, let's say for Saint's sake we were doing the Steam one and it landed on, like, Honey Pop, it w we wouldn't be able to do that, obviously. Um, so this is the game we landed on. I'm not going to lie, I don't really like the cover art. I already don't like where this is looking. I shouldn't judge it too badly. <laughs> I might just stream Honey Pop. I think in the past there was actually people who streamed Honey Pop. There are actual, like, Let's Plays on YouTube that do have fucking nudity in Honey Pop. Even though... It's just like, how? How have YouTube not flagged you yet? I got flagged for showing fucking, like, um, what was it, um, like Sayori hanging herself in DDLC, like, what? Are you kidding me, like? Ah, that was mad, like, that time. Because then I had to go back through all my DDLC videos and make sure they were all censored and, like, you know, puffed up and all that. I know it says there as well, it says 8 euro, but, like, I already have it in library, so it should be grand. Um... I do have a Honey Pop series, and when I fucking, like, did the Honey Pop series, the amount of censoring I had to make sure I do on the fucking thing as well, like, well, yes, Era Dying is pretty fucking mad. It is, I guess, but, I don't know, because I uploaded the first time, like, the original DDLC before DDLC+, Plus, and they didn't do anything to the video, but then when I uploaded it DDLC Plus style, they're like, hmm, we don't like this anymore. But yeah, I don't know. I guess I, I do kind of see it now, honestly. But, like, it is just annoying that, like, it was inconsistent with the way they laid out the rules for me at the time. Anyway, um, I don't, I'm not going to play the trailer in case there's music in it. Oh, wait, no, never mind. There's a first person aspect. This might not actually be that bad. Yeah, okay. Yeah, so the stream will be ending now. I'm going to uh, screenshot this. Just to make sure I remember. Actually, no, I'm going to write on the board. Just let me write up. E, X, I, was. Now I'm going to write up here. Export. Stream. So it's been a mad stream today. This. Oh. Ignore that. Right. Anyway. Oh, fucking hell. I'm tired, man. Thank you so much for watching the stream. Um, might be... I'd say I will be back tomorrow, because now I have an excuse to come back tomorrow, because we're going to be playing Eximus just to see what it's like. I have to at least play it for 30 minutes. That's the rule. Uh, if I like it, I continue playing it, just like the captain. But if I don't like it, I can just cut myself off from playing it. So, yeah. 
Who knows, maybe I'll play more Jump King tomorrow and lose my progress again. <clears throat> anyway, thank you, Pi, for joining us. Thank you to everybody else that joined as well. And, uh, yeah, probably see you tomorrow. Smile!